from Jewelry Maker. Did you know when you book on a Jewelry Maker workshop, you are given exclusive access to our Jewelry Maker shop? You can browse through special items and offers, be privy to selected discounts and deals that you can't get at any other time. Shop whilst you learn and grab yourself some amazing offers. For more information on workshops and available dates, contact our call center. Welcome to Jewelry Maker. We are part of the Immediate Media family. Immediate Media is a fast-growing multimedia platform company who operates some of the most loved brands across the UK. Our brands range from our other shopping TV channel, The Sewing Quarter, to our very successful magazines, such as Simply Knitting, Molly Makes, and The Radio Times. We work incredibly hard to inspire you and bring you lots of exciting ideas and projects. So whatever your creative needs, you know that our crafting family will be there for you. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Welcome to the Late Show! That was, I'm so glad that we got a proper little countdown then from Paul because myself and Emma, we were trying to release the cable from the tablet here. We're like this, pulling faces. It's not attractive. How are you? How are you? I hope you're really, really well. <laughs> Welcome to the Late Show! It's a colourway day. Now, we've had some amazing colours already today. I can promise you now, you are going to love our amazing, amazing star buy deals on our colourways this evening. Um, my name's Ray Carpenter, lovely to have your company here on The Late Show at Jewelry Maker. Uh, joined by the latest team, Phil and Paul in, ga in gallery. They are there, the boys are, the boys are there pushing them buttons. Uh, then we've got gorgeous Emma and Becky. Um, I'm hoping that she stood up somewhere because I always worried about our back. Uh, but there she is. She stood up, yay! <laughs> <laughs> Which goes, and Dibs is with us all the way through till 10 o'clock tonight. Look at the deep amethyst hair. I well, did it especially for the colourway day. You are rocking it. And you know what? <laughs> You were chosen specifically for the late shows tonight yeah. because of your hairdo and your amazing yeah. passion for all things purples and blues because that's what we're working with tonight, isn't it, colourways? Is, yeah, I, I actually clapped and jumped up and down when I got my email with See? my listings. Do you know what I mean? And so eagerly, eagerly, beautifully purpled hair ready for tonight's <laughs> show. Just for you. Just for you. That's the dedication of our dance. Yeah. That's the dedication right Attention there. Attention to detail. Oh, do you That's know what, what I mean? It's about. Passion. Passion for your work. Yeah. Honestly, going the extra mile. Guess why? Look at what she's been able to work with. All this gorgeous colour. <laughs> now, you know last time I was with you and we did a phenomenal uh. seed bead deal. Okay? It sold out in less 
than seven minutes in the live opportunity. Now, we opened them up for pre-order. Over three quarters of the stock went on the pre-order and then everything sold out in moments. Moments. So, guess what? We're opening this up for pre-order for you now for the next 60 minutes. Let's just go through what you're getting because it is absolutely sensational. The colours are beautiful. So, we have got for you your... Oh my gosh, they are just so incredible in their colours. Look at all these beautiful tones, first and foremost, that you've got. So complimentary. A lot of them are silver lined as well, so you get that stunning, stunning sparkle. And, and I have to say, I'm sorry, but these gorgeous size 15s, wait until you see these outside of the pot. They are amazing. So just to very, very quickly give you what it is that you're getting, and I'm going to have to read these for so two seconds. Uh, it is... We are getting your size 11s, and that's the uh, Mayuki Silver Lined Deep Dyed Purple Seed Beads. Then you've got the Mayuki Duracoat Galvanized Eggplant, that's a size 11. Then you've got a size 8 eggplant. Mmm. Aubergine to us here in the UK. <laughs> uh, 10 gone already on the pre order. Uh, then we've got the Mayuki Duracoat Silver Lined Orchid Seed Beads in the size 8. Then the Silver Lined Dark Purple Seed Beads in the size 15 that I was just talking about. And of course the Lavender Silver Lined Seed Beads in the size 8. All of those already. 16 gone on the pre-orders. We've just opened it for pre-order. The deal and the value for many is amazing. It's all coming up for you a little later on. Celebrating purples and pinks and blues. Although I wonder what the gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous things you got coming up for you. Time tonight. <coughs> Excuse me. Anyway, <laughs> we've got loads to squeeze in for you. Now, come and have a look at um, a bit of a cheeky opportunity that I've got for you a little later on. This is tonight's must-have, 8.30 p.m. Oh, yes. Mm, 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 mm. It's a must-have. Now, I don't know if Debs knows this. <laughs> Can I just say, I, don't, I, I think Phil's just like, oh, oh, I've just, I forgot to ask her. I forgot to ask her. No, he didn't mention um, it. No, I'm not going to make anything. Debs, <laughs> can we set yeah. you a little cheeky challenge with this one? Why not? Yeah. It'd be lush to work with anyway, wouldn't it? It would, I, yeah. I knew, I knew as soon as I was about to mention a challenge and Phil went, ah, ah in my ear, mm. ah. It was like a, hmm. <laughs> well, <laughs> she works hard for her money. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to hand that to you, my darling. Have a date. Thank, Thank, Thank you, you sweetheart. Okie dokie. Phil, what can I say? <laughs> you had one job. <laughs> <laughs> it's got a lot more than just one job, I can tell you. Uh, should we get this late show started? Lots to bring you. Um, we've got very last of stock coming up for you, as you know. Um, some very sort of on-gone moments. Make sure you've got us on speed dial. Make sure that you're joining us. I'm just going to just tap that. Ha ha ha. We're going to start with... Okie dokie. Why? I needed to, because it, the... Chris, the... <laughs> I'm going to tap that. Screen. <laughs> Screen. <laughs> Can we just, come on now, can we just discuss this? We're not, honestly, you, I mean, it's not too my early. fault. It's not my fault No, this it's time. not your fault this time. No. Do you know what I mean? Literally. This is uh, rose gold plated. Can I just say, I love the fact that this says rose gold plated solid stunning silver speaker chain, 1.2 millimeter, uh, millimeter link, and then in my precious metal, it says no metal. <laughs> <laughs> I think there is, I hasten to add. Um, this is 2.7 grams of solid sterling silver. It's rose gold overlay. The gorgeous quality of that rose gold is sensational. I promise you, can I just say, I think this is about the third or fourth rose gold overlay chain I've done since September. We very, very, very rarely get them in, do we? More often than not, it's our plain silver or our yellow gold. This is just going from strength to strength. Absolutely is. What I will say to you is if you're looking for your precious metals with that beautiful, beautiful pink tone to it, this is definitely a chain for you. Now, it's a 20-inch necklace, which is lovely. 20-inch necklace. Normally, we have a sort of 18 or a 17 as standard, sometimes even the 16-inch length. So it's nice to get that, just that little extra length on the chain for you there with that gorgeous pink gold. And of course, wait till you see your price for tonight. Real good treat. Mm. Eight 
95 on your screen. Now, I'm just going to take up the neckline for you. You can see the clasp is a lovely substantial size, but look at that for just a standalone rose gold chain. It has that really high-end look. You know it's got that beautiful, durable, solid sterling silver. It's got the quality of the 18 karat rose gold on top of it, and we've taken it to 8 95 just the most incredible price points. Not $19.95, not $29.95. Under £10 to kick off tonight's Late Show for you for a really beautiful and very durable and strong and very long wearing, gorgeous eight, uh, 20, I was going to say 18 inch chain and 20 inch chain. Now, no extender on this, but I'm just going to just drop that in. What's this? Stop it. I'm supposed to be moving house, but couldn't resist the purple seed beads. <laughs> Sally, it's all right. Just imagine throwing a little bit of glue on a wall in your new house. <laughs> seed beads. Oh. Abstract little work of art there for you. Uh. No. <laughs> Who did that? Somebody, Phil's just telling me that somebody texted no. me the other day thinking that his wife's blue seed beads were slug pellets, so threw them all over the garden. <laughs> <laughs> that's I, well, that's going to give some sort of sunshine shimmer <laughs> to the lawn, isn't it? So I can say to that. Make the oh, some very sparkly <laughs> slugs. <laughs> Make the magpies very happy. They'll be like, ooh. <laughs> Sparkles. Those slugs are going to be working that shimmer. <laughs> <laughs> Have you seen my coat? Um, Eight ninety-five on your screen. Sally, sorry, my darling, but lovely to see you tonight. I'm so glad you've got that beautiful pack already. They are gorgeous. Uh, hello to Marion and Ellen and Helen and Chris, collectors in Gloucestershire. Uh, this is from Mandy. Hi, Mandy. Yes. Finally, I've been able to get my favourite colour in seed beads, and those purples uh -huh. are stunning. So got two. Thank you, JM. Mandy, thank I you, don't my blame darling. You. Absolutely, go for it. The colours are mesmerising. They really mm. are. Beautiful, beautiful colours. So thank you so much. Um, good plan, Ray. I'm already working on a mermaid wall art piece. Oh, now, nice. Now, that is an image that we need to see on the Facebook page. Sally, promise. Promise me. Please. Love it. 895. Well done. Hold those lines. Congratulations. Okay. Now I've got a connect. This is really slinky. Really slinky. Um, I used to be the manager of a, um, of a charm collection called Karma Charm and, uh, for Gemporia and um, our Karma Charm necklace was amazing, it was such a beautifully made, amazing necklace. This is like a smaller version of it, the slinkiness, the quality of that snake chain, the way that this has been put together is gorgeous, have a look at it. Solid selling silver beautifully slinky. Can you see the fluidity of that? I mean, that is proper snake-like, isn't it? The way that that coils, the way that it unkinks immediately. Beautiful. Now, this is a connector, so I'm just going to drop that over the finger for you so you can see there that you've got the two quite nice size connectors, actually. 10 centimetres, 1.9 millimetres in diameter. Uh, solid selling silver with a rose gold overlay. The first time I've ever seen one of our beautiful snake chains in the rose gold. And I have to say, it's gorgeous, it's isn't really it? It's really nice, yeah. Really, really lovely. Now, you're getting the one piece... 1.5 grams of solid stunning silver. Please remember as well, of course, that you are getting a beautiful amount of rose gold. Should be at 7.95. I'm told. Oh, well, I'm told we can go to the lowest price ever. Brilliant stuff. Every little bit off that price will help. I promise you. We're going to take it to under six pounds for you tonight. Fantastic, fantastic, fantastic deal. Um, hi to Candy, hi to Pauline, hi to Collectors in Gloucestershire, hello to Anonymous Collectors, nice to see you all tonight. Really lovely to have your company. Hi Candy, I hope you're well, lovely. Uh, 5 95 on your screen. Hi to Michelle, hi to Madeline, hi to Collectors in Cheshire. Um, lots, oh, sorry, <laughs> drop mm. that, sorry. Uh, Sally says, I promise, the tail is made from chip forks painted with the amazing... The Bebo Fantasy paints and her wow. hair will be different gizmo wires. I haven't decided. I am absolutely intrigued, Sally. Wow. Sounds How amazing. That, doesn't it sound amazing? Yeah. Thing is, as well, with all those colours, you were talking about um, Claire McDonald's new hairdo with all those yeah. sort of mermaid and unicorn <laughs> colours in her hair. Yeah. 
And this is the thing, it's the craze at the minute. I saw this thing on Facebook yesterday where somebody's created a rose gold metallic hair colour. And I was like, ooh, <gasps> that is to die for. I'm so oh, honestly. Nice. Uh, yeah. Thing is, if you've got, if you've got, uh, yeah, if you've got the balls to do it, I was going to say, and I've said it now. <laughs> I stopped myself and then it came out anyway. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Can I just massively <laughs> apologise, team? That I forgot where I was. You make me feel so at home and comfortable. I forgot. So sorry. You're lucky I'm not in, in my PJs and my slippers, to be honest with you. Just, just resting. Just, <laughs> just rest. Chilling. Um, on the lines. Sorry. Sorry. But you, you know, you're brave enough to do it. Yeah. That's what I meant yeah. to say. Yeah. Mm. Anyway, <laughs> let's talk some gemstones. This is, that's all I am doing, Paul. It's all right. It's all okay, right? <laughs> 28 carats of beautiful, vivid emerald. Fasted rondelles, on the graduation, you've got a 2 to a 5 millimeter. 19 centimeters. Beautiful, beautiful colour. Every single one of them. The deepest of greens, field of greens, gorgeous, beautiful moments of landscape green. You've got such a wonderful tonality to this strand. Have a look at all those emeralds. Literally every single one has ranging from that peppermint green for the lightest, most beautiful crisp greens that you can see all the way through to the deepest forest greens. Every single one genuine. Now, I'm going to hazard a guess that that means that these are Zambian emeralds if it says Africa because there are very few of our strands that specifically come from the botany mines. So with, with knowing our team, as I do know our team, um, these are more than likely your Zambian emeralds. They've got such a ridiculously amazingly good price for you. Are you ready for this? 0800 29 carats of emeralds at 9 90 Five. And that is how we do our gorgeous, gorgeous prices for our gemstones. And again, remember how we source them. Remember you know, who it is that is sourcing our gemstones for us. It's still the same team that have been sourcing your gemstones for you for a very, very long time now. So you've got that trustworthy element to it. You've got, of course, the authenticity. And, of course, you can guarantee that every single one of them is ethically sourced and genuine. And that... With a 30-day money-back guarantee, it's a bit of a no-brainer, isn't it? $9.95 for your Zambian emeralds. Beautiful 19-centimetre strand there for you. Again, today we are celebrating our colours, uh, but very specifically your colourway. Uh, this from Rachel says, loving those emeralds, gorgeous and beautiful, gentle greens, my fave colour. See, this is the lovely thing about tonight. It's not just about concentrating on your blues, your pinks and your purples, which is pleasing for many, many, many of you tonight, but also Rachel is happy with the greens, which is gorgeous. Um, and we will have other colours for you other than your purples and your blues and your pinks, I promise you. But bearing in mind, each of your shows today has concentrated star buys on certain colourways. We have got that for you in a little while. Just make sure that you're holding those lines. Amazing price at 9 95 just make sure that you are checking out and confirming. Again, you see so many beautiful faceted rondelles with this for a reason, because they're so workable with your jewellery. Ah, oh, multi-buying going on as well. Gorgeous to see. Make sure that you are holding those lines. A little bit of a last of stock on that one, so good luck indeed. You hold those lines. Amazing value. Well done. Um, how many of our kits have gone, please? Phil? Thanks, love. Yeah, I can indeed. Um, we've got a seed bead uh, 50. Okay, so 50 of those seed bead kits gone already. So here they are for you. Coming up for you very, very soon indeed. And of course, we have got a fabulous masterclass demo from Debs as well. And pre nights up for you next. These are quite large pre nights for rounds, actually. Have a look at these. Six millimetres. My other half is a bit of a crossword addict. 
a little bit of a crossword addict and uh, loves to, you know, literally the, the, books and books and books. And he's very, 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 very clever at them as well. Um, and he's like, hmm, stuck on this one. What part? Pre-night. He looked at me as if I was a goddess for that moment in time. <laughs> Just for a, for a little snippet oh, of time, nice. I was the all-knowing, all-knowing. What I was like, it's like oh, it is yeah. pre-night. It fit. I was like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then there was something else that came up and it was an anagram and I was like, I don't know. <laughs> We've got a hundred carats of free night for you. Uh, six millimetre beautiful rounds for you. Lovely, lovely summer gemstone. Literally glows. It's got the most gorgeous melon colour and grape colour to it. Some little dark green moments of shots of inclusion. Three ninety five for a really rare moment of the pre-night. Mostly pre-night occurs in sort of mustard colours and sort of browns and greys. When you get that beautiful, uh, again, it is a proper green grape colour, isn't it? It's also got a lovely amount of clarity to it, which is really, really unusual. Brazilian pre-night, six millimetres, 100 carats, and of course, a really, really great deal. It's got to be said, I'm going to give that a little measure for you. That is a 40 centimetre strand. It's from Emily who says, I just had to have the kit. It is my fave colour as well. Emily, oh. you are one of the lucky 50. Over half of our warehouse quantity is out of the door on that kit. Oh, yes, it is a, a half of it out of there. Hi, Jane. Hi, Annette. Hi, Sally. Hi, Helen. Hi, Jane. Sally, you're supposed to be <laughs> packing. What you do? What you... <laughs> it's okay. It's all right, everybody. Sometimes you just have to do it, don't you? Do you know you? what? You just need a break from the packing yeah. sometimes. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, hi, Kerry. Hi, Teresa. Hi, Julie. Hi, Annette in Flincher. Um, Multi-buying going on as well, which is lovely to see. Natural gemstone, really important to remember that, of course. And an unusual gemstone, I think, to have in your jewellery. It's not a gemstone that you find readily available in any jewellers up and down the high street. There are some really big bespoke jewellers who are working with pre night in very unusual ways, carvings, that sort of thing. Amazing deal. Um, I just had to have the kit. It is my favourite colour as well, says Emily. Thank you so much. And Sally says, yes, I know, but it's so, ah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, mm. definitely. Yeah. All oh, those lines. It's a lovely colour to work with. Really lovely colour to work with. Uh, next. Yes, I have. <laughs> These are really pretty. Check these out, Debs. These are really pretty. How many have we got left? Fifteen. Not oh. enough to go around. These are really pretty. Have a look. Oh, they are. Aren't they yeah, really they pretty? Solid stunning silver. Leaf charms. Three of them that you're going to get in the pack as well. But again, just look at how beautifully delicate they look and yet they're in solid stunning silver so you know they're durable you know they've got a great wearability to them lovely bright solid stunning silver also in all of those three of them one price point again you know whether you're popping these onto earrings and then maybe onto a pendant or maybe you are using them as charms on a bracelet or maybe even on an anklet so many different ways that you can oof, not eight ninety five for the last fifteen five ninety five. Now you're talking massive, massive deals on our last of stock tonight. It is a little bit miss it miss out. I really need to encourage you to make sure that you are checking out on these ones tonight. Again, if you are pre-ordering on the uh, the first kit that we've got with Debs in our beautiful purples and lavenders of the seed beads, you're going to need to make sure that you are checking that out. $5.95, I've got 10 packs left and that is it. 10 packs of solid sterling silk. I mean, basically, you're looking at what, just under two pounds each? That's great for silver, isn't it? Solid sterling silver. So many of you there. Hi, Jenny. Hi, Clets in Gloucestershire. Hello, Caroline, Greater Manchester. Uh, everybody has pressed their button once on the phone lines. Well, well done indeed. 0800 644 655. Uh, some Rachel says, Hi, ladies. Always love your ideas, Debs. Can't wait to see what you've done with tonight's kit. Oh, thanks, Rach. Yeah, really. There's a beautiful, 
beautiful demo coming up on a really lovely level of detail. We've got some amazing Swarovskis as, as well as uh, sort of coming up for you as well as that, that Deb has used within the kit. Um, but we've got very, very few left of those. So uh, look, that the, um, the demo bit that, that Deb's going to show us is... It's almost, it is almost conch shell-like, isn't it? I was yes. just thinking of what, yeah. of course, um, Sally was saying about uh, Mermaidal. Um, yes, you could yeah, make you shells. Yeah, you could, couldn't you? You could make that. sort of conch shells out of this yeah. beautiful, this design. Really nice idea. Mm. It's coming up a little later. A little later. I can indeed, yeah. Now. How many do we have left, please? Twelve. Oh, wow, look at that. This. Right, I'm going to have to really say this very, very clearly. This is <laughs> crystal mesh. <laughs> mesh. <laughs> wow. It, it, that is, I mean, look at the fluidity for a start. It's like looking at the most amazing, amazing material. Now, I've got 12 left. They are Aurora Borealis crystal. <sighs> oh, my goodness. <laughs> that is quite spectacular, isn't it? On Saturday night, I went to a 1980s Dynasty TV-themed Hindu. Oh, wow. It was amazing. <laughs> it really was amazing. It's the one with Joan Collins. No, no, that's Dallas-themed tune. Dynasty is bum ba dum bum bum ba dum and then it goes a bit high. So excuse me. <laughs> bum ba da bum bum ba dum ba da ba ba da ba. Right, remember it now? <laughs> <laughs> Made you sing all of that and they still don't remember. Do you know what I mean? Um, but the reason I mention it is because Emma, one of the girls who was there, she had a beautiful cuff like this on the wrist and she was dressed like oh. Fallon from Dynasty. <laughs> I know, amazing, amazing. <laughs> uh, it uh, absolutely is one of the most sparkly and fluid. It's just like wearing sparkly material. The fluidity, the way it drapes is amazing. 26.95 on your screen. 96.95. Absolutely. Who, who just said that? Becky just said she was born when? In 1993. <laughs> 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 I was just about to go into my A-level. <laughs> I'm not saying what well, I was okay. doing. <laughs> Hi, two. <laughs> Glad to me, to Helen and Chris, to Isabel, to Carolyn. Great to have you company. There's so many of you there who are absolutely all over this opportunity. Can you imagine what will you be doing with this? How will you be working with it? Are you multi buying? Because my goodness me, to work with this beautiful quality Swarovski, the Aurora Borealis colour is mesmerising. Paul, can I ask a favour? Can we have a little bit of Dubba dubba da dubba dubba da soft focus. Is that all right? Ooh. Can, can we? we do soft focus? Oh, yeah. yeah. Do you know what? Paul's all over this. He's like, oh, yes, we can. Nice. Think of 1980s, a little bit of Vaseline around the camera <laughs> lens. Oh, look at that. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Amazing. Oh, it's so good. <laughs> that was worth it. Did you see that fire? That the way, I've got to say, the way that Shirovsky are able to do this, the uniqueness, the uniformity. Oh, 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 oh. Now you're just showing off, Paul. <laughs> oh, it's like top of the pops Honestly. in the 1970s. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> Linda, <laughs> Sally, Colette's in London, Isabel, Carolyn, you're in Derry, huge. You'd like, make sure that you're checking out. Um, Mandy, I says, uh, she says, I have this, it's out of this world. Def, uh, def I recommend it to everyone. 
quite something special. Really, really is. Please do make sure that you are holding the lines on that one for those of you who are checking out of your web and the app. Good luck indeed. Uh, it's time for our first star buy of the night. Rose, beautiful design, solid stunning silver flower connectors. <laughs> Fifty-six of our fantastic. Oh, that was Welsh. Sorry, I heard myself. <laughs> but our fantastic. I was <laughs> our fantastic kits. You can tell I've been home for a few days, can't you? <laughs> our fantastic kits. Fifty-six have sold out already. <laughs> Uh, even the engine. <laughs> <laughs> but I, I've done quite a few auctions in actual Welsh, Paul, over the years. You thought it was a made-up language? Mm. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, we have 56 of our beautiful seed bead kits left, is what I was just about. I'll translate that for you. <laughs> <laughs> but right now, solid studding silver flower connectors very very pretty look at the level of the detail brushed solid stunning silver in the center and then of course that beautiful satin finish just on the petal edges solid stunning silver as you can see every one of them stamped 925 solid stunning silver they are 11 by 6 millimeters 11 of course containing the connectors either size and then six across really 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 pretty Absolutely beautiful. Simply on its own in a bracelet or of course all joined together to create something really, really beautiful. Maybe with pearls set in between them on a necklace. There's so many ways we can work mm. with these, aren't there, Debs? There are. Uh, and they're a really nice size as well. So they're, they're going to work brilliantly with, um, you know, a, a really beautiful six mil pearl or yeah. something like that yeah. for a bridal piece or it's they're so as pretty a for an earring yeah absolutely gorgeously designed i mm. love the attention to detail because you've got that lovely sort of brushed finish in the yeah. center then you've got the satin finish on the sort of the edges of the petal to bring yeah. out that level of the detail and that's where the luxury is isn't it the luxury is in the level of the detail yes, on something totally. like this now, solid stunning silver, five pieces, 3.3 grams, and so much scope to work with these. And of course, you could, of course, pop your own sort of uh, your own embellishment on the reverse there if you wanted to. If you wanted to engrave them, maybe put your own stamp on there to a sort of ensure that everybody knows that you have made these. Uh, Jane says the flower connectors would be nice as a ring, definitely yeah. nice and delicate, very very pretty, not too Good. ostentatious, not too over the top. Don't get me wrong, we've got pieces tonight like that abalone, for example, that would make an absolutely stonker of a gorgeous ring but not everybody wants that somebody likes something a little bit more delicate a little bit more intricate oh and by the way to the lowest price you will have ever set your eyes on for these five connectors at 8.95 8 one pound and 79 pence per flower connector on your screen and they are very, very pretty. Really, really pretty. Very feminine, beautifully romantic, like Debs was saying. Perfect for wedding jewellery. But also, of course, as well, everyday jewellery for those of us that love something pretty yeah. and feminine and delicate. Uh, this from Rachel says, could make a beautiful nightwear set. Always gorgeous to go out wearing flowers. Definitely. Definitely. And think timeless, Rachel, as well. You're so right. Mm, yeah. Absolutely timeless, isn't it? T Never yeah. going to go out of fashion. There's no age range to a flower either, is it? You know, it's not, no. it's not sometimes, for example, when you see a certain piece of jewellery, you know that it's aimed specifically for maybe yeah. the younger generation or the older generation. But what this is, is just totally and utterly classic, no matter your age. It is. It's a really classic design. Isn't it, um, Jess? And with it being the rose... It's got so many connotations, Absolutely, hasn't it? So. so many. I think it's one of those ones where if you've got it in jewellery that's on your jewellery stand, it's 
always going to sell. Yeah. Always yeah, going to go will. because yeah. people just it, it's just a, such a classic. Yeah. There's no sort of sort of you know ties to oh well it can only be for this age group or it can only be for this type of sort of you know for somebody who loves maybe something really sort of quite striking sort of yeah. maybe um, what likes to wear quite edgy clothing but actually a classic piece of jewellery would look amazing. You're there on the phone lines, you need to press your button once and multi buyings going on as well, which is really, really lovely. 8 95 11 by 6 millimeters, five pieces, the best price that you have ever seen for these five solid stunning silver connectors. Do make sure that you're checking out on those there, won't you? Do make sure that you're checking out. Now, less than half an hour until we bring you the full access to our first kit. Now, I'm going to show you the kit. We have 57 sold out. How many, can you remind me, sorry, uh, please, Phil, how many did we have? 98, so less than 100. So over half have gone. We've got 41 opportunities remaining. We've still got 25 minutes left to go. The entire beautiful, you, have, you don't have to choose which one of these you want. You're going to get all of them for one phenomenal price coming up of course with our deb uh, deb's of course is going to bring us an amazing demo guaranteed of course but please do make sure that you're checking out we've also sent a set a little cheeky challenge last minute um and that's coming up for you very very soon indeed so looking forward to that uh, hold the lines well done yeah, yeah 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 of course we can which ones oh yeah of course we can okay <gasps> Wow. And they are absolutely oh. huge. 12 strands left, okay? I'm just going to, did they are, there are 12 strands and that's it. Um, these are absolutely enormous with regard to their size. Absolutely huge. Now this is an organic gemstone, so size matters. 16 by 23 millimeters on average in size 12 by 16 as the smallest now the colors are wild when it comes to the collaboration of color that you're getting these are gigantic i'm going to take them to the neckline for you i want you to see the impact that these sorts of sizes are going to have because we haven't had anything with regard to these sorts of sizes in our pearls. Look at those colours, right? There is a gold mixing with pink iridescence, uh, beautiful purple iridescence, amazing greens, turquoise, mesmerising. Four instantly in baskets. Not checked out as yet, but allocated. Now, I'm just going to show you that entire beautiful strand and the pearlescence. Now, all the colours that you're seeing here, they are all coming out of the freshwater cultured pearl oyster and the mollusk, and of course, and they are, there's no nucleus placed into that. So they literally free form. Isn't that amazing? Look at the size. Absolutely mesmerizing quality, and they are so solid. They really, really are. It's not like a thin shell or a thin veneer. They are a solid, beautiful pearl. They've been drilled all the way through the middle. We've done that for you. We've got eight strands left. It is the most substantial strand of la large size pearls. Now, um, Phil, could you remind me how many we first we, we ever met, we ever had? We've only ever had a hundred. So we had a hundred. They came to you in a massive deal of the day. Practically sold out. We had the last final 12 that hadn't been checked out successfully. The final 12 strands in the world that hadn't been checked out. Now it's a 41 centimeter strand. I am gonna count how many of those pearls that you're getting. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 18 on the strand. Now you could put 17 on a neckline piece, one as a ring. Let me just show you the size of one of those, 18 of them on the strand. Organic, luxurious, works out about 
three, just under four pounds per massive pearl. Hi, Mary and Helen and Chris. Hello to collectors of Merseyside, Margaret, Anonymous Collectors, Maxine, Michelle, Parvinda and Daisy. Hello to Eva, well done indeed to you. I need you to check out quickly as you possibly can. Absolutely beautiful. They will sell out before the end of the hour. There's so many of you there. Huge good luck to you. What a joy to actually feel the weight of that mm. strand as well. Yeah. Because, and that's when you know that it's not just a sort of shell and, and sort of, you know, sort of a little outer shell and nacre. It's a really dense nacre where layer upon layer upon layer upon layer upon layer. They're not hollowed out. They're not shell pearls. These are really hefty, beautiful weights. Um, and you've got a 30-day money-back guarantee. So you can send them back to us, no questions asked. I've got Maxine, Parvinda, Daisy and Eva just waiting to check out. Huge good luck to you. That's four collectors. That means that I'll be left with one single strand. Oh, that must be mine then. Oh, you see? <laughs> there we are. I see nothing in the madness there. Just sewing that over to <laughs> <laughs> uh, to make sure that you are checking out and confirming huge good luck to you on that absolute mesmerizing quality and do let us know what you're going to be doing with those beautiful pearls they are very substantial very head turning sizes really quite i'd call, call those sort of queens of the uh, the freshwater pearl farms really because they are so big they really really are unlike any sorts of sizes on biwa pearls that we've really seen you know, the width of them is substantial. They're not sort of, you know, sort of slimline pearls. They're a really beautiful width and depth. Just three of you left to check out, and there's three strands left. Best price that you've seen for this strand is on your screen. Huge good luck to you. Huge good luck. They are beautiful, aren't they? Really are. Um, can I just say to Mary, to Helen, Collectors and Merseyside, to Michelle, to Margaret, Parvinda, to Collectors uh, Anonymous, well done indeed to you, uh, to bidders in the Midlands, well done indeed to you. Um, Ray, they are huge. What would Debs do? Are they smooth? Well, mm. they're very organic, very organic. Let me just show you, because you can see they have that beautiful irregularity about them because they are organic, but yet they do have a lovely smooth surface, yeah, don't they, they do. Debs? What would they you do. be doing with them, my lovely? Um, I would Gosh, probably, I and I'm going to be dead predictable now, one on a long chain for yeah. earrings, so that's two gone. That'd be lovely, and not overweight for oh, earrings, but, move but they would and, move yeah, and catch the light and gorgeous. give that radiance. Yeah, yeah, definitely. And then the others, I would rosary link with pieces of chain in between, so I've then got a set. Yeah. And that would do a, a long line necklace. Yeah. Yeah. No, absolutely. For me, that, that just sits, that suits beautifully. Totally classic, yeah. wearable, something yeah. that's going to last for years. Absolutely. Beautiful. Uh, can you look, watch what happens as I tilt it back? Just seeing on the big screen there in, in the studio. I'm just asking, just this one here, okay? Mm. Just watch. I was like, look at that. There's greens coming pinks through, and, pinks yeah. coming through, gold. One stand left. They are fabulous. Fab, fab, fab. Okay. Say that again, lovely. <laughs> 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 Make sure you are checking out on those, won't you? Well, well done. Um, yeah. Okay. Yeah, of course we can. <coughs> Excuse me. Now. <laughs> this is the thing. I think it's the air con. Makes your nose run, doesn't it? Does. It does, like, yeah. Whoop. It does. Um, these are lovely. <laughs> okay, so. These are quite substantial bead caps, actually. We're used to seeing um, quite sort of delicate, quite dainty oh, bead caps. But these are quite substantial. Nice. Yeah, they are, aren't they? But yeah. look, look at the of detail in these as well, though. Look at that oxidisation. Not overpowering, just enough to bring out the level of that detailing. Do you know what that's looking like? If, you've, if anyone's got um, a pearl, yeah. a li just a little rice yeah. shape, Pop that in the centre and it'd look like a little snowdrop. Oh, yeah, it would. Then, yeah. You know, with a, yeah. a wire. Yeah, it would look lovely, wouldn't it? Really lovely. Almost like the other petals are dropped. Yeah, it yeah. would. Beautiful. Really beautiful. Let me have a look um, inside there as well Gorgeous. so you can see. Really nice. The oxidisation takes on the inside as well. Beautiful amount 
are genuine. If you see, again, the size of that, I'm just going to hold it on the end of the finger so you can just see, really lovely and substantial. We never normally have bead caps that are of this kind of what presence size and it? size. 10 by 6. Yeah. yeah. Really lovely. Oh, it'd be beautiful for um, uh, a ring. So turn it up yeah, the other way. Yeah, upside down. And yeah. put a, just a round gemstone in, in there. Lovely idea. Yeah. And then just a really simple, clean shank. Nice. Very, very nice. And gives it that almost, you know, when you have, what would you do, say, Paul? You put some pyrite in there. That's all, yeah. yeah. Why not? Definitely. Yeah, it, do you know what? It has got that marker site feel to it. Yeah. If I just show you what Paul's meaning by that, if you look at the uh, oxidisation on this, I can't speak for some reason tonight, I don't know why. <laughs> Struggling. Um, oxidisation. And just have a look. It almost looks as if it's got that beautiful marker site gunmetal grey colour to it. It would look so good with it. Um, 10.95. Vintage look. Really beautifully classic. 1095, not your price. Um, we're gonna take it even low for you for the last of stock on these tonight. Absolutely gorgeous. Lovely size, just as Debs was saying there. 10 by 6 millimeters on the size of it, 795. 795. Five grams of solid studding silver, detailed solid studding silver. You get six of them in the pack as well, which is lovely. Wow, that's just yep. under a gram each. Absolutely beautiful quality. Ooh. Really, really nice. 7.95 grams of solid selling silver. Now, just to warn you, over 70 of our kits have gone. We only had 98. So that might be a sellout before we've even started the opportunity for you. If you want the seed bead kit, and I, I, I honestly, I honestly believe that we will need to be seeing sort of kits like this in the sort of 200 quantities soon, and that 100 is just not enough for you. Um, that is all coming up for you about 15 minutes time. Uh, hi Tara, hi Irina, hi Rosie, hi Alison, hello Anonymous Collectors, well, well done indeed, lovely to have your company. Do make sure that you're checking out and confirming as soon as you possibly can. Uh, hello to all of you on the phone line tonight, join us, hope you're well, hold the lines, talk to the call centre. Don't forget as well, one postage and packaging price the entire day and a 30 day money back guarantee as well. Well, well done. Okay, so that goes back into box number 14. Yeah, of course we can. Look, let's have a look at them. Okay, so, um, within the kit that we have for you with Debs coming up, there is also an opportunity to have the colour and the sparkle on these is amazing. We'll open these up for pre-order for the next 15 minutes. Now, there's only 70 of these, which is why we haven't opened it up for pre-order for you um, as, as sort of early as the other. Um, but this will be so worth the wait. Now, I'm going to give you a big heads up on this part of your kit because we've got the pinks and the purples and you know that that's the sort of colourway that we're looking at tonight. You've got your beautiful fuchsia bicones and your heliotrop, beautiful, beautiful appearance in the, in the purples and the blues here. Now, you've got the large size heart Swarovskis. Then, of course, you've got the beautiful bicones. And it's the same on either side of those. Now, um, just so that you are aware, right, a friend of mine bought a pendant Swarovski on a chain with just, with just one of these suspended. Just one of them suspended in a chain. Yeah, forty nine ninety nine. She paid for that. I was with her four years ago. Four years ago, Swarovski heart in a pendant, solid stunning silver, little bale on a chain, forty nine ninety nine. Just saying, all of that's going under fifteen pounds. I know it's so good, and it's available <laughs> for you for pre order. Now, it's going on right now on the web, on the app, and on the phone lines. Um, it's going under £15. Now, look, I'm not saying for a second that everybody is going to be sort of making those as pendants or earrings and charging £50 for them. But I am telling you, four years ago, what my friend paid, I was with her at the time, what she paid for a Swarovski fuchsia-coloured heart with just a simple, simple, simple jump ring and bail and on a silver chain, £49.99. Nine. Yeah. Hey, Paul, guess
guess what? I've got some pyrite for you, buddy. <laughs> Look at this. Pyrite and proper metallics. Graduated plane rounds, five to six millimeters. So it's not a massive dramatic graduation here. But you can see that it's a beautifully subtle graduation. 140 carats of your genuine Peruvian pyrite. Natural, unenhanced, and really, really beautifully, beautifully glossy. Now, the reason I say that is because pyrite has a tendency sometimes to be quite dull. So to see it with such a high metallic sheen is amazing. Now, can I just say, have us on speed dial for this strand, because it's about to get silly. 8 95 on your screen. We're taking that price point down for you. It is going to be the best deal you will have seen, I guarantee it, at 5 95 on your screen. You have got genuine, unenhanced, to see it unenhanced and so incredibly glossy. Not a single, I can't see any hairline fractures at all in these. And pyrite is a gemstone that really does suffer with sort of almost a dull uh, metallic sort of body and some hairline fractures. 140 carats for 5.95. It's got a lovely, lovely it brightness to it, hasn't it? Yeah, really, really nice. nice. It's like an antique gold, yeah, isn't it? Yeah, absolutely. Which would work really well with those bead caps. Yeah, it would do. Little flower it would ones. do. Yeah. It would indeed. Uh, hello to Rachel says, uh, this past weekend and today has been the best yet. I've loved what everyone has done with their kits. It's so amazing, giving me so many ideas. Well, oh, Rachel, we're, cool. we're going to continue with that. I really promise you we are. I definitely, the, with the, um, the component section of the necklace that Debs is going to show us how to do in the next hour, just after seven o'clock, it is definitely going to be worth the wait. And another thing is, another reason why I'm so glad that you've bought your kit already, um, because for me, is, it's not just about sort of grabbing it before everybody else, although well done for that, but it's also about being able to sit back and watch the demo mm. and take it in and get your questions in without worrying, have I got the kit or haven't I? Has somebody else got it and I've not been successful? That happened a lot on Wednesday and Thursday of last week. Many, many, many of you got in touch with me saying, I missed out on the kit. Is there any chance we're going to do anything like that again? Uh, we're looking into it, but I will say these opportunities to pre-order, not to be sniffed at. No. Uh, do make sure you're holding those lines. Well, well done. Now, another star buy for you coming up next. Beautiful, solid, stunning silver pendant bales next. <laughs> <laughs> just humour me for a second. I'm just trying something. Right. Okay. <laughs> this <laughs> this is just exactly, exactly what my friend bought. I honestly cannot believe that we've got this. So, you know the Swarovski? So the Swarovski heart from the second part of that kit that's available under £15 guarantee. Remember the one that I was saying that my, uh, my friend bought just one of those hearts like this with a bail <laughs> like that and a chain, £49.99. She paid for basically that and a chain. When I saw these bales just now, I was like, you, you've got to be kidding me because that is mm -hmm. almost exactly how it was exposed. So, you are going to get solid sterling silver bales, not the Swarovski, you need to bid on the kit, of course, if you want to get hold of that. And literally all I've done is I've opened up the bale, pinched it back together, and there's your Swarovski pendant, good to go. Now, we've done a chain for you all, albeit in the rose gold, but we've done a chain for you tonight at 8 95 My friend paid 49 99 $49.99. We have got some solid stunning silver chain for you later. As soon as you start saying Swarovski, some people are unwilling to pay for it. They really, really are. Anyway, 
Anyway, obviously they will also work with our genuine gemstones with your drill hole as well. So I'm just literally going to take that back out for you. That's how easy it is. Um, solid stunning silver. Solid stunning, even I could do it. <laughs> Go take the pack home, pop them on eBay, off we go. <laughs> uh, solid stunning silver. How many of these um, packs of bales have we got, please? Okay, so we've got three in a pack. Six ninety five on your screen for you. Solid sterling silver, and you get, look at the quality. Solid sterling silver. Add that beautiful Swarovski heart onto a charm bracelet, like so, and you are good to go. That is amazing, amazing value, isn't it? Six ninety five. Now you've got a big size pendant bale, approximately twelve millimeters from the uh, the large bale through to the holder. Martin and Julie and Jill and Anonymous Collectors, well done already checking out. And so many of you on the phone lines of these. Now, bearing in mind, okay, so you've got one, two, so you've got eight. No, I'm lying. No, you've got one, two, three, four. So you've got ten of those different Swarovski, um, beautiful Swarovski uh, pendants. Yeah, so you've got ten in total. Five of the pink and five of this mesmerising mesmerizing mystic color which is hugely hugely satisfying to look at i'm just going to pop one of the bales through the look at this multi-buy multi-buy on the bale packs if you're buying the sarosk amazing amazing value for money look at that how simple was that that's so good <laughs> Pop a chain on there. Pop's your uncle, find your aunt, 49.99. No, I'm not saying that you should charge 49.99, but you know what I mean. Amazing value. Do make sure that you're checking out on those, won't you? Absolutely fantastic, fantastic opportunity. And so easy to use. Literally, I'm just using my fingers to prise open the silver because it's beautifully malleable. Pinch it together because there's a, a lovely substantial amount of silver there. And then 6.95 for the price for three of them. Absolutely brilliant deal. Brilliant, brilliant, brilliant deal. Love a bargain like that. Uh, Stacey says, trying to get ready for a stall and do orders. First time doing seed beads with a kitten <laughs> around. He's cute, but not helpful. Excited for the demo. <laughs> Stacey, really lovely to hear from you. Thank you so much for messaging in. Uh, good luck with uh, trying to make the draw for the orders. Uh, I don't know what to say. Uh, I'm, I'm hoping that you haven't got reels of maybe a sort of cord or maybe any of your thread around with a kitten. Because, you know, that's just a nightmare waiting to happen, isn't it? It is indeed. <laughs> um, Stacey, nice to have your company. Six ninety five for the pendant bales. Absolute steal. Um, look, we will be sold out of both parts of the kits in the next 10 minutes. So you've got time to pre-order on them very, 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 very last chances before we bring them live. Please do make sure that you are checking out. No hesitation, after our very short break, proper, full-on kit moment and demo with Debs. Absolutely all the time in the world to listen to Debs and really take in what she's doing on the other side of this. Welcome to Jewelry Maker. We are part of the Immediate Media family. Immediate Media is a fast-growing multimedia platform company who operates some of the most loved brands across the UK. Our brands range from our other shopping TV channel, The Sewing Quarter, to our very successful magazines, such as Simply Knitting, Molly Makes and The Radio Times. We work incredibly hard to inspire you and bring you lots of exciting ideas and projects. So whatever your creative needs, you know that our crafting family will be there for you. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share.
The Jewelry Maker Wall of Fame is where you get to showcase your skills as a jewelry designer. Each week, one lucky entrant will win £100 credited to their account, and the runner up receives £50. If you want to enter your design, just send a photo to studio at jewelrymaker.com or you can post your photos to Jewelry Maker, Ivy House, Henley Road, Outhill, Studley, B807DU. Get making and good luck. Did you know when you book on a Jewelry Maker workshop, you are given exclusive access to our Jewelry Maker shop? You can browse through special items and offers, be privy to selected discounts and deals that you can't get at any other time. Shop whilst you learn and grab yourself some amazing offers. For more information on workshops and available dates, contact our call center. Do you need a helping hand to get started with Jewelry Maker? Are you stuck for ideas and need inspiration? Then visit our Jewelry Maker website where you can find our video tutorials. Expand your knowledge and skills with these easy to follow jewelry making demonstrations. Whether you're a beginner, hobbyist or business owner, there's always something new to learn. It couldn't be easier. Simply click and learn some new jewelry making techniques. Welcome back. What a weird conversation that was during the break. Yeah, it was very weird. It was, uh, anyway, uh, <laughs> I won't share it with you because it will put you off your tea. No. It was a little bit gross. Uh, anyway, welcome. And it wasn't me this time. No, either. no, 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 no. It's quite a normal conversation until Phil came in the room, <laughs> if I'm being honest with you. <laughs> welcome. To the late show. This is all to do with our fantastic kit. The price is on your screen. Uh, we've only got 19 of those kits left for you. 19 seed bead kits left. We're not surprised. We're not surprised. They're literally. Um, say that again. We've got 19 opportunities left. And mm. right, hang on. Let me get this right now, please, Phil. 17 kits left. Sorry. And 19 in baskets. Oh. Okay. okay. Um, we had 98. They are selling out. Now, let me just give you a quick rundown of what it is that you are getting and bring you those <clears throat> gorgeous colours. So, they are all the shimmering shades of your purples. Deep purples, lavenders, gorgeous silver-lined Mayukis. You've got your size 15s, you've got a size 11 and a size 8 running through all those gorgeous packs. And, of course, such amazing colourways. So many of you got in touch with us saying about the colours of this kit and how you are so excited. So if you've multi-bought on this kit, you're that excited. Now, obviously... There is a, a real sort of focus in this part of the show, of course, with the lovely Debs. But also, um, Debs has incorporated the beautiful second part of this kit with the Swarovskis. They are also available for you to pre-order before we bring you in the graphics. Now, there are only 70 of part two. We've got two left, one left on those kits. They're sold out. Good grief. It, it, we just knew, we just knew when we saw that tonight we had the, uh, the fantastic colours and the fact that it's seed beads in a kit for one price, we just knew they were going to fly mm. out. Um, we're not surprised, are we? No, it's absolutely amazing kit. It's, I well, loved it. it. You've I, worked, I, you can tell you have. I can't wait to see you show everybody how we're going to get that beautiful effect in the uh, in in the necklace but obviously as well how it can be translated we were talking earlier because yep. sally messaged in saying that she's got a, a mermaid project on the go and you've got this sort of almost sort of conch uh, shell sort of style scalloping here now graphics on your screen for the second part which is your sorosky element so you've got the gorgeous hearts uh, and the bicones in this one. Um, again, I just I really do want for you to think about what it is that you're getting with these ones. You're getting 24 bicones 
in the crystal heliotrope, of course, which is four millimeters in size. You're getting the zillion heart pendant. Um, you're getting a six pack in the heliotrope and, of course, the fuchsia. And then, of course, you're getting the bicone fuchsia beads as well. The colours on them are amazing, absolutely beautiful. And if you've got hold of the bail pack, the solid sterling silver bail pack that we had for you just moments ago at the end of your star buy, um, please, feel they, they work beautifully with the zillion hearts. Absolutely amazing. In fact, we're bringing the graphics for you for the solid sterling silver bales at the bottom of your screen. Now, just so that you know, we only had 70 of this part of the kit. We had 98 of the seed beads, 70 of the Swarovski. Now, 30 have gone. 30 have gone already. Thank you so much. I guaranteed it under, oh. guaranteed it under 15 pounds for you. 30.95. It's good, isn't it? That is good. Really, and I've got really, loads, really good. Loads left. If I. Yeah, absolutely. Gorgeous. Look at those colours. I know, they're fab. Oh, they're so sparkly. I like a magpie to them, honestly. <laughs> Gorgeous. Do make sure you're checking out. Please do. Now, if you were just buying the beautiful zillion hearts, so £1.16 and pence each, and then just literally throw in those bicones. Amazing value, incredible value, isn't it? Really, really is. And the colours just work so beautifully. Let me bring in the colours of the kit. They work beautifully together, don't they? Absolutely. I tell you what, it is such a gorgeous collaboration kit. It really, really, really is. Could just attach a few of these now to your hair, Debs. You would, you'd lose them. But you would just see a little bit of hint of sparkle every now and again in, amongst <gasps> your curls. I could do that. I could thread it onto hair. Yeah. Ooh. <gasps> Tomorrow, festival day. I could do that, couldn't I? Do you know what I mean? Gorge. Yeah. Make sure you're checking out. Um, can I That'll have some names on my screen, please, Philippe? Thanks. Oh, lots oh. of names. <laughs> Just one Hi. or two. <laughs> so we've then. Hi to Lena and Emily and Elizabeth and Jackie and Fiona and Catherine. Hello to Tricia. Hello to Jennifer and Ellen and Margaret and Helena and Venetia and Alison and John and Janet, Lexi and Cumbria, Francois. Um, to Julie and Julia and Louise and Angela and Belinda and Susan and Irina. Uh, Lexi and Tyne and Weir, welcome. Uh, Greater London Multi Buying, Michelle Multi Buying, Barbara, Sardia, Susan, Sharon, Vera, Lexi in the West Midlands, Sally, Helen and Chris and Tracy, Lexi in Warwickshire. Wonderful stuff. Evelyn, Viv, Jennifer, Jill, Angela, Isabel, Doring, Julie, Geraldine, Lisa, Newcall. Ah, oh, welcome. So good to have your company. 30 day money back guarantee, of course, with us here. Uh, details on the bottom of your screen right now for those solid studding silver bales that we had for you earlier that would work amazingly with those zillion hearts. Now there's 15 left of this kit. We only had 70, 15 left. Now while you're getting involved, I'm going to pass over to my partner in crime for the evening and probably tomorrow <laughs> as well um, as we bring you your demo. Now, let me just pop this off the, uh, the bust for you. And we're just going to just show. I'm going to show you down camera two first before we show. Because this is the section that we've asked Debs to demo tonight. It is fabulous. Not, not that the rest of it isn't absolutely beautiful and so full of colour, but... Yeah. That, just as the actual necklace, the yes. chain of a yep. necklace. OMG, that would be amazing. That was my plan, but I, I just ran out of days. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> You've got to sleep sometimes, do you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. A couple of hours here and yeah. there. Sleep's but. for losers. It is, yeah. Yeah, we need to dead, sleep. <laughs> <laughs> so you're going to demonstrate this section Show for you us, how my to darling. Do that, aren't you? Yeah. Thank you. Right, and in that case, it's then, just repetition. But so. do you know what? It, the effect is amazing on it. But as well, you can you can get really sculptural with it. And I almost did this, made like a strip, and then you can fold it and reconnect it in parts. Beautiful. So you end up 
with What's sort the... of some sections and then these could fly off and you Gorgeous could have feathery idea. bits and all sorts with it. But yeah, it's um, it's nice that way around it, as it, well. It so. feels really, it, I love the way it holds its form. Yeah, it is really quite, it's, it's like magic the way it Absolutely, it's, it. it's, it's like material, it's like a fluidity. It's like yeah. we were saying earlier about the, um, the Swarovski um, mesh that we had, that the yes. way that it drapes, you know. And yeah. Enough of the oohs and the ahs. It's Deb's turn now. Okay. <laughs> You're going to take us through. Okay. Yep. Um, first and foremost, right. what size needle are you using? Because we will size always go size 10. What uh, thread um, are you using? Just the wildfire. That we normally, yep. that we normally yep. sell. Okay. Fabulous stuff, thank you. So, <coughs> excuse um, me. What we've got then are the size 15s. Yep. Two lots of size 11s. The colours um, are amazing. And then the purple and the pink size 8s yep. at the end. But you can do, um, you can really change the way this looks by using different sizes of beads and different combinations okay. of bead. So once you, and really it's just a peyote stitch, mm -hmm. the, the thing that makes the, the flat, so if you look yeah, at the necklace again, again let me sorry, let, that's all right, my darling. so this is peyote stitch here, yeah. this section here, this section here, yeah, which is, now which I'm going to test myself, yeah. pick it up, Mm -hmm. Skip it. Yep. And then pop it in. Yeah. Okay. Good. Look at that. <laughs> anyway, yeah. so, okay. So you do that and it comes out flat. The yeah. reason that comes out flat is because I've used the same size bead all the way through. Okay. So because you've used the size 15, that's where it's gathering it. Yep. So Very the size clever. 15 makes it all shrink in and then the size 8 is providing the bulk, if you like, and the, and the larger section yeah. on the top. Okay, gorgeous. So that it's the size of the bead. The stitch is basically the same. Okay, my lovely. Um, and then to get the stripes, you either need to pick up the colour you're coming out of, yeah, or the colour you're going into. Okay, my lovely. And it will become clear when we start. Okay, doing so it's not smashing. Okay. I will keep this to hand in case you require okay, it again. Yes. Yeah. Cool. Okay, so. We've got on our yeah, thread. Yeah, it it's a little difficult. Ah, oh, that's better. Thank you, sweetheart. Marvellous. Okay. So we've got six of the size 15s. And then the colours are quite similar with these, um, these two. So we've got two of the paler pink. Um, I can't remember what colour this one is. Is that lavender. the lavender one, yep. that one? Um, so two of those. Two of the um, size eight in the purple, one of the pinks in the size eight, and then two more of the purple I've in been, I've been to get the size eight description because it helps, ah. again, doesn't it, my darling? So the dark purples are the fifteens. Yep. Then we've got the duocoat lined lavenders in the eight. Lavender. Yep. Is first. And then you've got the silver lined orchid in the eight. Orchid. Yep. That's it. Yeah. There we go. Then eggplant and deep purple. Egg. Yep. Yeah. Uh, that's Just, the eggplant, yeah. isn't it? That yeah. one. So the eggplant yeah. is the 11s. Oh, not the 8s. That, the 8s are lavender. Yeah. That's cool. So the deep purple so and the eggplant are the 11s. And then this silver lined orchid and, and the dark. Yeah. There the we go. Pinky one at the there end. we go. Okay. So <laughs> we've got those threaded on. And we've got a nice long tail um, that we can uh, hold so that we can keep the tension. And also uh, that gives us some thread to be able to then stitch in back into the, okay. the piece mm -hmm. or um, carry on working this way if we wanted to. Okay, my lovely. So we've got the beads on there. I'm going to just take that. Right, so, if I move that, would it be better on white? Can you... A little bit, let me just move that over a little bit, there we go. Yeah. Um, okay, so, what we need to do is start working back up yep. along this mm -hmm. row. And to begin with, 
you're doing it and you, you keep thinking, this isn't going to work, this isn't going to work. Um, but just keep going. Persevere. <laughs> <laughs> so what we need to do is start off putting in um, a pink. Okay. So one of the orchid in the size eight. Yep. Okay. So I'm going to ignore the first lavender one. Yep. And come into the second mm -hmm. lavender and just pull those together so they sit into a little triangle. I don't know. Can you see that? Yep. Yep. Okay. So then we're coming out of a lavender. Yep. So I'm going to pick up one of the lavenders. Yep. And I'm going to miss the orchid and come into yep. the lavender. Okay. So carry on going up. Yep. So we're coming out of a lavender, pick a lavender up. Miss the next one mm -hmm. and into first size eight. One of the size 11s. Oh, the size 11s. Yep. Hang on a minute. No, you are right. Let me give you the colours again <laughs> on that one. It is um, size 11 galvanized. is galvanised eggplant. Eggplant, yeah. It doesn't actually look like eggplant colour at all. I would have thought eggplant was deeper. Yeah, more like the, yeah, the one right yeah, up the... Yeah, um, because it's aubergine, basically, isn't yeah, it? But there we are. Yeah, it is. That's OK. Yeah. My Yuki can make up colours as they want. They can. <laughs> um, six kits left of the Swarovski on your screen. Six. And there's 29 in baskets. Even me with my pants maths <laughs> can work out pants that that's not maths. enough to go around. It's official. That's a fact. Actual phrase that is technical is phrase pants maths yeah <laughs> recognized yeah mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm just thinking if I put that there you might be able to see it a bit better okay my lovely when I pick the colors up okay so we're coming out of an eggplant yep. color going to miss the next eggplant and we're going to come into the next bead which is um size eight uh, size 11 again, okay, sorry. Okay, so that's the deep purple seed bead on yeah. the size 11. So because we're coming out of um, the eggplant, we're going to put an eggplant on our needle and then push that through the other bead. Okay. Okay, so now... We're coming out. Which colour was that again? Oh, so that Sorry. Was, that's all right, my darling. That was the, that's the silver-lined deep purple seed bead in the size 11. <laughs> I know. It's fine. It's too, every, time too, too up, many purples. every time you pick one up, I'll go, deep sea. Yeah. <laughs> I purple. normally say the blue, the red, the white. <laughs> but no. it's the, all purple, that. the purple. The <laughs> purple. Into the purple. The slightly lighter purple. <laughs> Deeper, darker purple. <laughs> They're great colours, though. They're so beautiful. They are, and they work brilliantly. So we're going to miss this one. Yep. Okay. And go into the first one of our violets. I think they're a violet, are they? Uh, these are the silver-lined dark purple seabed in a sound 15. Yeah. Oh, so I could actually call those size 15s. Yeah. Because they're the only size there 15s we go. See, we've got. Work. Yeah. Okay. That's a solution. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so now pick up another of the size 15s. Go into the next one. There. Sorry, so I dropped one of the beads down and then went into the yep. next one. So drop a bead down. Pick a bead up. Through into the next one. And then one more. Okay. So how many in total have we so picked up there for those ones, the size 15s? We've got, I think we had six on to start okay, with, okay. so we should have picked three up. Okay. So if I give it a little bit of a pull, they tend to then sit. Okay, my lovely, yep. Jaggedy. So we've got one, two, three, it's four, like a Jenga five. tower. Five. Yeah. Yeah. So actually, I've put too many on, haven't I? Yeah. Because now what we need to do is turn at the top yep. and come back down. Okay. So 
we're going into this um, dark purple here. So I've yep. got a dark purple on the needle and I'm going to bring that through. Hang on to the tail so that it doesn't slip through. Spin it round. That's the problem with the size 15 sometimes when They're we're demoing, tiny. isn't it? It's just that they are the smallest yep. of sizes, which is, you know, we're as close as we can get on that overhead camera for you. So, go through. So all I'm doing is coming back, filling in the gaps and taking the next bead down. Yep. So... So the minute, into, which is simple peyote, yep. just the, the base, it, and it is, for me, it's been the most, bait, as in the, the peyote stitch, there are more complicated ones. But yeah. this, it, I have to say that even the most basic one can create something really quite spectacular. Oh, it can. It doesn't need to be all that complex to actually get something amazing mm. coming out of it. Um, and the patterns and the colours just work so mm, well. They do. The, the colours so, are beautiful. I, I think yeah. everybody who's been successful enough to grab one of these and lucky enough to grab one of these kits is going to be grinning from ear to ear with these colours. Definitely, yeah. And they'll work with so many of the other colours that you've already got at home mm. anyway because of the, the tone in them. Definitely. So what I'm doing is, is looking at the pattern that, I, that I've started and it's quite tricky to see to begin with but the stripes start to run diagonally. Yeah. So um, it's easier to see in the, the darker ones how they're starting to, uh, to go. So if I now, I'm coming through this, I'm going into the silver lined. Yeah. So pop one of those. Now I'm coming out of the orchid yep. and I need to put another orchid in, in the, gap, there. the yep. gap and through into the size 8. So start, <gasps> no that's wrong, 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 <laughs> go back, <laughs> that one because I'm coming down into, so what my stripes are going across that oh, way. Oh, okay. Okay, so actually I need yes. to put this to fit into this gap here. Yep. So I've put too many of those on. So just take that off. Well spotted. <laughs> it's so difficult on my TV though to see though. Yeah, it is tricky. Otherwise what happens is you'll get a line that suddenly does that. Mm -hmm. And actually, that might be quite a nice effect if you wanted to do it. But if, if you're you don't, continuing it through the whole thing, yeah, if yeah. you don't want it, it's not. Details for those lovely sterling silver bales that we showed you with the Swarovski Zillion Hearts are fully on your screen right now for you. If you wanted to add those to your order. Okay, so pink. So if I carry on adding in. Uh, lovely Deb, bottom. so glad I'm recording this. Thanks. <laughs> I'm sorry, Sally. Sorry, Sally. Yeah, definitely, my lovely. Because it, 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 it's one of those ones online when you're sat at home and it's in front of you and the light's great. Yeah. And you know you can, can, can it, but on live TV when they're smaller size, it is difficult to get you know to, to be able to see that it, pattern forming. But it will yeah. soon take place, won't it? It will. It will. And there, I mean, there, the the graduation in colour is quite. Um, it is quite gradual graduation in colour. Yeah. So it's, it's quite difficult to actually see yeah, yeah, yeah. the difference between. You're doing brilliantly, um, that, darling. Don't have to. It's, it, we're all so, good. Right. And actually, I have done it wrong because I can now see in the light that um, I've picked a purple one up instead of a pink one. Gloss because, over. Because. Don't worry about it. But we'll pretend. We'll, we'll pretend. pretend. It's all right. It's fine. Everybody yeah, squint a little fine. bit. <laughs> <laughs> Right, so um, coming back up, what we need to do is remember that we want our stripes to work. I mean, actually, 
you can mix it up anyway if Absolutely. you wanted the colours to because the it's, size is it's more about it's more about as well being able to get that beautiful twist the shape. and the shape on yeah. it anyway my darling so as long as you're sticking within yep. your sizes yep. don't stress to start with about the no, colours no they're all incredibly so complementary the because colours anyway aren't they they are they are yeah i can just see one of these is the wrong colour there so um We'll ignore it. Yep, absolutely. <laughs> what we need to do now is um, to start coming from the uh, size 11s yep. and working our way back down to the, the dark ones, okay. size 15s. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to pop one of the um, orchid. Yep. No, it's not, is it? No. Nope. The, um, we almost need a little machine. light on the desk so the that you can plant. see those colours it's properly. It's eggplant. <laughs> it's eggplant. It's that one. Yeah. It is. Yeah. It's eggplant. It's the galvanised one, isn't it? Yeah. So I'm going to pick up an eggplant <laughs> and feed my needle through the next gap. But you can see... You can see exactly the same as in a mm, flat mm -hmm. peyote, how you've got the little um, sections yep. starting to to form, you know, like the little yep. castle turret. Mm -hmm. So you can see that starting to form there. So we've put our first of our smaller beads, our size 11s, in here now. Yep. So this will start to form the curve and the, um, the shape. And it is that that shape. It, it is. It, I've not seen that in our seed beads since I've been back in September at all. It's lovely to see it. Really lovely to see it. And what you were saying earlier, because you were absolutely right in playing with those, with that. It's almost like material where you can shape it. Yes. Yeah. As it well is quite as fluid. Mm, it is beautiful. Really, really lovely. And so, again, like I was saying earlier, Sally messaged in saying about the, uh, the mermaid. There is definitely conch shells to be made from that very pretty design. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah. Or even, I mean, you could do it so that it was a larger um, sort of dome. and use, So use more of the larger size beads yeah. um, in your, your eight or your sixes even. And have, um, you could... Do it so that it was the mermaid's mm. tail. Yeah, yeah, of And course. then graduate down at the end. Yeah. Which would be quite cool. Or the shells. <laughs> yep. There we go. Very important. Yep. Every mermaid needs a couple Absolutely. of shells. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Or very, very long hair. <laughs> <laughs> so, you can see how yep. the lines are starting to... Yep come across you can see with the larger ones it's easier to see them when I get down to this size right so you'll not see any of this now <laughs> <laughs> just come in start putting in the no I need one of the amethysty ones lovely into the blue I'm calling that one blue the size 15 <laughs> it's easier do you know what we're going to do next time? We're just going to put the names in the next um, few. Yeah, I'll so bring can... little, um, little stickers, little stickers little names, with little me. Bit. Dark purple, 15 Mayuki rounds. Yeah. Cool. Uh, this is from Michelle. Um, hi, great show. Love the hair, Debs. When I see me with multicolours, once I have set the pattern, I forget the colours. And yeah. I A, B, C and D them. You, well, when you are doing it at home, you do totally forget the colours yeah. and you just, because I've got them in order, yes. they're running down in order yeah. here. So I just work down, picking up yeah. in order. So, I mean, it's because I'm talking of at the same it's, time. And then it's distracting it's like, as well then when you're trying to make sure that you're getting that lovely pattern of colour. It's all all right. It's, it's, it's fine. All good. You can, all good. You can get the idea. Yeah, absolutely. I know, I, 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 because it's, it's very... It's, it, it's one of those one of those moments where you've got to ask questions all the time about it, though, isn't it? It is. Yeah, it is. Right, so we've come back up to the top. Yep. And now we've got to come back down. So I'm going to pick up one of the size 15s. Back in through 
there. Yep. And then you might be able to see this now. Move back through. Um. Have the kits sold out, please, Phil, while Debs is just doing that bit. So the our uh, first kit sold everything sold out. Absolutely. Yeah. Well oh, done wow. you. Well done you. Everything sold out. Well done. That is well really done. cool. Bales on your Ooh. screen are the ones that we showed you earlier that would fit in with the zillion hearts. We've got some lovely tourmaline nuggets coming your way in a matter of moments as well. Okay, so I'm working back down towards myself. So I need to put in the colour of bead that is the next... So the next bead that I'm going in through yep. is the colour that I need to add onto my needle. So if you look, my next one is a purple, yep. one of the size eights. Yeah. So put that on. Yeah. It's got a lovely gleam to it, that one. It has, it? yeah. It glows, mm. doesn't it? So the next, whoops, spillage. Come back. <laughs> <laughs> so the next one um, that I'd be putting my needle into is a purple. Yeah. So I'm going to pick up a purple, size eight, and come through there. And now I'm into the pink. Yep. Orchid, orchid. It's okay. We're all good. <laughs> I'm going to have nightmares about orchids tonight. I can see it's already it. getting that lovely sort of bend <laughs> though, isn't it? It is starting, yeah, it is. Um, and now we've got to come back with one of the purples and then back with an orchid. Not an orchid. Eggplant. Eggplant. <laughs> and I've done that wrong again now because I'm concentrating on the it's all uh, good. Don't worry about it, my darling. on the pesky uh, color right off i'd switch <laughs> phil and paul off if i were you <laughs> i wasn't i wasn't actually listening to them they could have been saying you've got to finish now and i was i was ignoring them they're having a lovely chat in there are they I'm um Sally says uh sections of your design would look amazing with shibori now wait yes come and have a look look no, 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 but there's a lovely little, but look. They've got a lovely little bit of sari silk in there, though, Sally. Gorgeous. <laughs> I've had that loitering in the uh, workshop for years. Beautiful colour, though. It Perfect. is. It was waiting to be used. It was, yeah. It was. It was sitting there and just talking to me. Use me. But definitely, yeah, shibori's would work beautifully with that. Lovely suggestion there from Sally, who's got two of these kits, by the way. Yeah, because some of the colours that we've got in the Shibori, absolutely amazing. Oh, they, um, with those peaks and the valleys in the colours as well. Yeah, it would, yeah. Some, these colours would look amazing, some of the Shibori, they would. definitely. Yeah, they would. Right, so we're working back up. Now, when yeah. it, the reason I keep going wrong is because I'm not watching what I'm doing. And when I... When, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so when, when I come back down to the bottom, I have to think about the next row that I'm going to be adding in. Because my rows are coming across mm -hmm. diagonally, my next row needs to be back here, the next colour along, yeah. mm -hmm. if that makes sense. Because mm -hmm. we've worked all the way up to the top of the ridge, now we've got to work back. So the next colour is the purple-ish ones. Size 11? Or a size 8? Size 11. Size 11, it's the silver lined, deep purple seed bead, Yay, size 11. Deep purple. Yep. Okay. Get head banging into my head and then I'll be fine. <laughs> so I've, I've added that one in, so that's now ready to start my next row that comes off this way. So if I zip my way up here yep. a bit speedily, so through there, pop a pinky one on. Through the purple. Yep. I've got these the wrong way. Through there. And you can see where the gaps are sitting ready to yeah. be mm -hmm. filled with the bead. One of the aubergine. Eggplant. <laughs> You say potato, I say potato, I know, it's fine. Yeah. <laughs> Don't worry about it. 
it's like um, zucchini, isn't it, as well, and yeah. courgette. I was about to say That's yes, the cucumber. Yeah. <laughs> it's green, it's long, it's fine. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Colours have gone out there now. Oh, well. <laughs> say that they do. Back to seed beading. Yeah, back to the size 15. <laughs> right, so we're back up to the top again. So now I only need to add one of the really dark purple ones in, size 15. And then we're coming back. And to come back down, I'm going to add in the colour here, which is the um, purple. Oh, okay, okay. Okay, so um, we've got amethyst, oh. copper, shibori silk ribbon available, half a yard. Um, how many of them? 30 of the shibori ribbons left. Um, you should be able to see that on the website. So let me, I have indeed, hang on a moment. <laughs> there we go. Oh, that's yes. just going to work beautifully. Now I know you're not going to see the colour properly through a screen through a screen, but you've got some beautiful. But yeah, mm. have a look at it on the web and the app. And of course, if you don't have access to either of those, I'm really really sorry. But just so that you know, um, those coppers they're like a pinky colour, so that's, the pinks and the yeah. that would work beautifully, Heavenly. wouldn't it? Yeah. Uh, we've only got 30 of those half yard amethyst copper shibori silk ribbons left. Um, 7 dollars 95 Yeah, 7 95 Amazing. Really great value. That's, um, that's absolutely really, beautiful. Really, really good value. Really gorgeous. And um, you'll get loads in there as well. So you oh, can do yeah. multiple pieces with that. It was amazing seeing when we had the Shibori weekend. It was amazing to see how yeah. like half the yard of Shibori would, how far it went. That was my first time actually using Shibori. And um, I was on with Amy. You were, yes, you we did. We did the launch, yeah. didn't we? Yeah. It was the birthday week with, yeah. uh, with, when Amy was over. It's yeah, amazing. It's fantastic. How it, yeah, it was, wasn't it? Absolutely gorgeous. Really good. I loved it. Yeah, the shibori she's got is amazing, isn't it? Beautiful The shibori. colours are mm. Yeah, just amazingly gorgeous. Right, so we've come all the way down, and now I'm starting to put the blues in that are at this corner. So here... We've added the next um, size 15 in. So this is where the shape will yeah. really mm -hmm. start to get pinched in. Yeah. So my next colour is one of the deep purple. Mm -hmm. And then one of the eggplant. Yep. And then the next one going to be an orchid that's already starting to give that form so, to it now isn't it yeah mm. yeah and then the next row you'll really see it coming in it's difficult to actually do this in stages so i'm, I'm sorry you have to keep watching me just put beads on <laughs> no no but, you know, but I was, the thing is as but, well the thing is is that what's really lovely to see is that it, it, it you know demos will be going at the minute so we started it just after just after 10 past so it's not quite half an hour yet. Right. And yet that's demoing it, explaining it. Yeah. And then, you know, setting it all up to go. So it just shows that other people at home will be able to, sort of, within sort of 15, 20 minutes, You'll get that first section done, which yeah. is great. If you have a look at the um, necklace again at yeah. the bottom, yeah. um, there's that small um, section just there yeah. at the bottom. And that's a slight different variation. So I changed the order and the number of beads that I was using. Um, and it's created a sharper, yeah. almost point to it rather than a domed um, section. So you can really have, you know, have a play change it up. It, yeah, it? have mm, a play, definitely. see what, what you can uh, what you can do. I just think the colours of both the kits just are... Oh, they're, they're Brilliant together. Yeah, really complimentary. Absolutely brilliant together. Gorgeous. Such complimentary colours. Gorge, gorge, yeah. gorge. I, I 
when I got my kit listing through and I saw the colours that I had, I was just like, it's so, Christmas! Yes, so <laughs> happy. <laughs> You can see now, it's easier yeah. to see which bead you need Needs to pick to go up. Where, now that you've had a see, few yeah. of those roads and the colours One, coming through, yeah. So, I mean, what you could do if, if you find it difficult to start with is um, not worry so much about the colours. Just get the shape started mm -hmm. and then, you know, just fall into putting the colours in and getting, getting a pattern going a bit further on because that quite nice as well so we now need to put a size 15 oh it will hang on all tangled <laughs> I was getting attached to it then it's all right so. should be able to see it in about I don't know about a minute if I just zip You'll be able to see how, when I pull it, this starts to then come together. Yeah, so it's already started that lovely curve shape, hasn't it? It has. You can see how, once you pull the smaller beads mm, in, mm -hmm. um, it will start to A couple to of curve. runs up and down yeah. is all that's needed, really, isn't it? Yeah. She says, because she's not stood here doing it. It's that easy. That's a yeah. <laughs> My demo's you could up do next. The next bit. Have you got four days? <laughs> <laughs> that would be just me threading the needle. <laughs> oh no, needle threading's easy. Mm. <laughs> it's a it's a, a trick. Beautiful, beautiful quality. It's, uh, it is, it's, it's just so, it was really enjoyable. I think what I did when I, um, when I started was I sat down because I hadn't done any seed beading for a couple of weeks and I just said, right, I'm just going to do something that I'm really going to enjoy mm. and just almost play. Yeah, absolutely. You know, You've got so many different um, so many different weaves and so many different... Well, I know that a lot of it is, is your peyote, but you've yeah. got your plain peyote here on this section here. You've got this beautiful... What's amazing for me is seeing the variety of a look that one particular peyote stitch can bring you. Yes. It's fascinating. Yeah. It really I mean, is. So, I mean, just looking at it you can see that it is exactly the same technique mm. and the only th difference is the size of the bead um, really that's making it curve you can see on this how that's now yeah, it's already actually to curve. Ooh, curved yeah. oh I'll leave it down there I like it. <laughs> <laughs> you can see already yeah so you can see that's got the yeah. curve shape happening Beautiful. It's gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. So you just carry on doing that and repeating. Keep checking back on onto your um, onto your stripes. Yeah. And and putting the next colour as it comes along. They so. look phenomenal, absolutely phenomenal. Uh, a couple of you have asked if we've got any gemstones to collaborate with your CBs, because I know a lot of you like to mix your mediums, so bear with me. Oh. Uh, yes, darling. So, okay. So, we've got, yeah, these would work beautifully, would. these colours. So, um, this is your 7 by 8 Black freshwater cultured potato pulse. For those of you who love to mix your mediums, oh. just showing you your gorgeous colours here. Mm. Yeah, really. Be Look at the sheen on that colour as well. <laughs> oh, my They're goodness. incredible. Beautiful. For those of you who do really love to mix your mediums and you love your gemstones with your seed beads, a couple of you have asked, Phil, is there anything that you've got tonight to go with that? Yes, is the answer. Uh, these are your 7 by 8 millimetre pearls. Uh, 7 by 8, 38 centimetre strand. The colours are amazing. Now, I would say, and forgive me, I'm going to, these are more eggplant in my mind. 
I agree. Wouldn't you think? Yes, I agree. There are definitely a more sort of aubergine tone coming to these, do you not think? Yeah. I yeah. would class those as almost yeah. a sort of pinkish tone rather than the eggplant. That's they more are. eggplant, that, isn't it? That's more eggplant at the end, definitely. yeah. Definitely. Well, we're yeah. not going to argue with Mayuki. They can do what they like. We'll, but we'll send them just, a letter. We're just saying, <laughs> in our mind, you've got some funny coloured eggplant, dudes. <laughs> <laughs> 1195. <laughs> argue yourself. I don't know where dude came from dude. or why that word came out of my mouth. I don't. Hey, dudes of Mayuki! <laughs> I have no idea. I'm sure if I met the Mayuki family, I'd be going, hello, hello Mr. Yes. and Mrs. Mayuki. I wouldn't be going, hey, dude! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Just no. Dude. Just, I don't know where it came from. I can only apologise. I forgot where I was. Okay. Twice in one night. Oh 11.95. That beautiful stuff. <laughs> Last stock on this one. Slightly smaller size for you on those pearls as well. <laughs> <laughs> Again, definitely, definitely would say that these are more those peacock and gorgeous sort of eggplant colours or aubergine colour. <coughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> Black freshwater cultured pearls, um, seven by six, beautiful pearlescence. Really, really, really strong. I think you can see that straight away from this strand. Beautiful radiance of colour. Again, working amazingly with the colours that you've got. I have to That's say, with the, um, with the zillions... I'm just going to grab yeah. one of them and pop it there just so you can see. Look at the colour of that zillion with your actual hearts. Yeah. That's perfect, isn't Beautiful. it? Beautiful. Oof. 9 Oof. for that strand. Fantastic value we are very well known for the price of our beautiful pearls it's got to be said but also the quality of our pearls yeah. genuine freshwater cultured pearls as well for you amazing peacock colors rich aubergine and eggplant greens purples and deep teals all in those strands very complimentary to the kit both of which that have sold out so well, well done if you got a hold of that. Thank you so, so much indeed. Beautiful, beautiful stuff. Now look, we have got another kit, of course, coming up for you tonight, um, which contains the most amazing cabochon tanzanite. Oh, it's beautiful. It yeah. is gorgeous, The blue isn't it? is just mm -mm -mm. fantastic. We're looking forward to that. Really it's good. a nice carat weight size cabochon as well, coming up for you very, very soon. Thank you, Debs, my You're darling. Welcome. I know that it's difficult when we're in the studio and the light. <laughs> the lights are a little bit in an odd place. I'll when do you were standing, next time. it meant that you were in a bit they, in a no, shadow, they are. which is very they are. strange. But yeah. yes, but look at that, Paul. Um, they moved your lighting, did they, it Paul? Did, it changed a couple of weeks ago, yeah. I'm going to say was definitely a definite shadow going there. There is. Mm. It needs mm. it needs sorting out. We note to the management. <laughs> <laughs> the Lee mail going off after the show tonight, I can tell you. Uh, listen, don't go anywhere. We've got amazing deals still to come for you with some stunning Bumali next. Sorry, we're still going on about the lighting then. <laughs> <laughs> it's all good. Um, well, to be fair, I was I could see the colours, but I could see yeah. them on the screen. It was you were it was, it's moved and there was a shadow and you couldn't see yeah. the colours properly. No, I can see them now, standing back here. <sighs> you say nothing. You make a little note of it. We send it off to the big big guys upstairs. I do carrots of multicolour, beautiful tourmaline. Oh, they're so vivid in their colour, aren't they? So vivid. Yellow tourmaline, pinks, reds, little shimmering shades of blue, deep greens, proper, proper vivid electric green as well. Really quite sensational. Wow. Gorgeous colours, aren't they? They are really intense. Mm -hmm. They really are. And some lovely nuggets as well. So every single one of them 
has got the drill hole going straight, straight through the centre. Now, obviously, these are your small size nuggets. It's an extremely long strand at 85 centimetres. But just look at the vividness of some of those greens. They are rivaling what I've seen in this building when it comes to chrome diopside. Mm. Those vivid greens. Yeah. Proper full-on green. And that beautiful uh, and quite seductive, gorgeous, rich pink. Flashes of red. Really, really delicate pinks, rivaling that of some of the pink spinel that we've had here. Got jet black tourmaline. My gosh, wow. I can't remember the last time I saw jet black tourmaline. No, it's been a while. It's normally yeah. as a rutilated inclusion yes. in a quartz. But you can see there's some beautiful jet, again, very similar to your black spinel in appearance. They are masters of disguise when it comes to all the, blood, the gorgeous, beautiful colours of the rainbow. Some sort of pastel blues coming through here as well. Rivaling wow. that of your aquamarines. That's just incredible though. Haven't seen some of those colours. It is, without a doubt, the ultimate in colourways. Oranges, yellows, pinks, reds, greens, deep sea greens, and then those amazing blues and the jet blacks. Lovely variation of colour. Really gorgeous colour. Proper Wim Oh, it is. Wimbledon green tourmaline. Definitely. Yeah. You're going to love the price. Love it. 100 carats. All genuine and natural. And all yours at £7.95. You know, it, again, you have to think about, I know that they're nuggets, I know that they're not sort of properly faceted, they are just tumbled and then of course, but you've got to remember, they are hand drilled, every single one of them, dead centre, threaded onto the silk that you've got there. I would say, restrand, definitely, because of course, it's a temporary strand that they've been put onto, but if you wanted, my goodness me, look how much colour that you would get from a really beautifully, beautifully saturated tourmaline bracelet. Now my mum has something very, very, wow. very, very similar that it's all been sort of knitted, so it's all on jewellery elastic and then the jewellery elastic yeah. has been knitted together, so it's like a cuff, yeah. um, set with some pearls. Yeah, um, nice. Absolutely beautiful, beautiful, beautiful bracelet. Um, of course, from Demporia, ages ago, but it's made by our same team who've put this strand together. Mm. You know, so this is the thing. Seven ninety five for you on your screen. Hi to Helen and Chris. Hello to uh, to Trish, to Sue, to Karen. Karen, sorry. Hi, Celine. Hello to Pauline. That's in the West Midlands. Kirsty, uh, Greater London. Jill, Charlotte, and Bobbin County. Durham evening. Lovely to have your company. Make sure that you're checking out anonymous collectors as well. October's birthday. One of October's birthday. And of course, October celebrates Opal as well as its birthstone. But there is so much gorgeous colour. Yeah. Oh, an amazing tree of life. Yes, Michelle. Yes. Definitely. Absolutely. Thanks, Debs. Thank you, sweetheart. Yeah, that would be amazing, wouldn't it? Thank you, sweetheart. That's all right. Yeah. Because you've got all blossom colours as well oh, then. Do you know what I was just thinking? Cherry yeah. blossoms with the greens yeah. and the pinks. Yeah. Oh my goodness, yes. Is that just tiara twists on wire? Essentially, <gasps> yeah. Isn't that so if Look at all yeah. the different colour wires as the... <gasps> I love that idea. Really lovely. Oh, I really, really, really think that's such a beautiful gift idea. Beautiful. Yeah, you can get yeah, tree of life and pendants as well would work. Yes, Brooches. Yeah. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful setting. Absolutely, Michelle, you have just hit the nail on the head with that one. Great suggestion, my lovely. Yes, you could do a nice. beautiful Japanese Sakura Blossom sort of yeah, style tree of yeah. life, couldn't you? Yeah. Really gorgeous. Um, good luck. It's look like a little bonsai. Yes. Yes, Daniel <laughs> son. <laughs> Love it. Gorgeous stuff. Well done. Well done indeed to you. Thank you for passing that over, That's Deb. That's right. Thank I'll you. Put it um, yeah. Um, well, I can't. I can't show it to you because I've given it to Deb's. What's that? Oh, where is it? Oh, there it is. Thank you, sweetheart. Have you just done this? Yeah, I did it before the uh, the kit hour. Well, gee, <laughs> big and she's good. Oh my goodness. Now. See this double-sided, beautiful abalone heart? 
Now that is available for pre-order now. It's coming up in just over half an hour's time. We set Deb's a little challenge. I'll tell you what, stepping up to it or what? Beautiful necklace piece. I'm going to take that up to the neckline to show you how effective that is going to be. Look at how head turning, how that's going to sit high up on the neckline. Beautiful statement piece. It would have been nice to just pop a drop, a, a, one of those pearls or something mm. just dropping off the bottom. Just a tail off. Nice. Yeah, yeah. I love the prong setting on the wire because you've just totally left that beautiful abalone yeah, exposed. Completely. Yeah. You don't want to be covering no, it. No, not even even the wire amazing. allows light to come through on it. It's yeah. gorgeous. Really do you know what it reminds me of? The Cinderella carriage. Oh Do you know what I mean? Because yes. you've almost got Yeah. I know? made one of those out of wire work. Beautiful. Was it this year or oh, last did year? You? Yeah. Amazing. Yeah. It reminds me of that. It's very fairy tale. Yeah. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. That's coming up at half past eight. Half past eight for that beautiful abalone. Well done. Um, squeezing in. Yeah, 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 of course. Solid selling silver. Vintage connector for you. Coming up. And then, short break and miss it, miss out from eight till nine. Nine o'clock, we've got the second kit oh, with Debs. One. It's so pretty, isn't it? Yeah. It's really pretty. Yeah. It's, um, it, I don't know why, remind, I went, when I was in Paris years ago, went to a jewellery exhibition in the Louvre, it was oh, on, like, on a limited, nice. uh, limited time, and some of the pieces of jewellery that were these museum pieces were amazing, and for some reason, this just sends me back there, that vintage sort of uh, yeah. Louis V sort of, you know, and Marie Antoinette era yes. in all that yeah. gorgeous silver work. Love yeah. so pretty. Solid stunning silver, vintage oxidized connector. Now, if you're thinking to yourself, well, where's that oxidization? It's inside the curves of the silver that just lets it sit and lift out. 8.95 on your screen. 8.95. Beautiful solid stunning silver. Just going to show you the reverse as well there. 27 by 18 millimeters and 8. 95. You've got such a gorgeous look. You've got the connectors either side there as well, so you can see. But also lots of places there, of course, if you wanted to place more gemstones, more of your seed beads on. But I have to yep. say, it, it is a beautiful and, and detailed, pretty, pretty connector, isn't it? It is, yeah. Yeah. I had it in a kit last year. Oh, did year. you? Fabulous. Um, it was right at the end of last year, around Christmas time, I think. Okay. And had it, I set it on the side of a necklace and had lots of layers of pearls coming round. It was really we, nice. Was that one of ours? I have a recollection that it might have been one of ours when I was coming back just to cover over Christmas. Oh, I wonder if it was. No, no, it no, wasn't. it wasn't. No. Okay, I'm just no, obsessed with because, pearls. Because um, we've only worked together once or twice before this year. So we, we didn't, yeah, not last year. That not, didn't make sense. Apparently it wasn't. But it wasn't. wasn't it wasn't me. That's okay. <laughs> anyway, you on your screen. Uh, do make sure that you check it out as quickly as you possibly can. Oh, yeah, just six, uh, seven, four, six, five, five. Listen, make sure that you stay tuned. I've got the most amazing, richly saturated lapis lazuli -like coming up for you. Next hour is Miss It, Miss Out. It's fast, it's furious. There's an awful lot to get through, of course. Deb stays with us, so if you've got any more of your gorgeous questions for her, of course, all the way through till 10 o'clock, get them in as soon as you can. You can do that by the web, the app, and, of course, via text on 60777. Send your text to, uh, of course, start it with JM Studio, otherwise it goes off somewhere. And, of course, then Deb joins us from nine o'clock for our second kit which contains a gorgeous cabochoned tanzanite there is so much still to take stay tuned for tonight here don't go anywhere you can watch our jewelry maker show every day on our website by clicking the watch and buy online link in the top right hand corner of our homepage. Jewelry Maker have an extensive range of DVDs for all abilities. Each of our mediums has an introductory DVD to help you get started. If you're already an experienced jewelry maker, we have a collection of projects and more advanced DVDs to take your designs to the next level. We are always filming new DVDs with our specialist guest designers, so visit our website for more information. 
You can now book Jewelry Maker workshops online. Just head over to our Jewelry Maker website and click on the workshop link. We have a wide range of workshops from beginner to intermediate covering a variety of mediums. Once you have found a workshop you'd like to attend, simply click on the book now button. Fill in the required fields and then press continue. This will take you through to the payment page. If you have any questions, you can contact our workshop coordinator, Wendy, at any time by emailing workshop at jewelrymaker.com. We look forward to seeing you. Owning a strand of genuine gemstones is always exciting but being able to use it in your handcrafted jewellery, then passing it on to its new owner with proof of its authenticity is even more incredible. Why not add one of our printed authenticity cards to your order and share that same feeling with your customers? You can also access online authenticity certificates for items you have previously ordered by looking at your order history on your account details. The certificate gives you valuable information about your purchase and is your guarantee of quality and peace of mind from Jewellery Maker. Buying from Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. When we bring an item to you, all the graphics come on screen. And this gives you all the information that you will need to know. From the item code to the product description with all of the key information. Then the price comes on. And whether you join at the beginning or at the end of the offer, everyone pays the final on-screen price. So, when you see an item that you would like to buy, simply pick up the phone and dial our free phone number and you'll get through to our UK-based call centre. Alternatively, you can join us at www.jurymaker.com and start your jewellery making journey today. Jewellery Maker, the one-stop shop for all your jewellery making needs. You can watch us every day, 8am till 10pm on Sky, Virgin and Freesat and every day from 8am to 1pm on Freeview. Hello and welcome back. Lovely to have your company. Uh, my name's Ray, you're joining us for the Late Show. Gorgeous to have your company. Um, we've had the pinks and the purples for our colourway as the start of the show. We're moving towards those violets and those blues for the rest of the night on your, uh, your amazing kind of focus moments. So this star bite focuses on some gorgeous blues. Um, we have got for you what was once upon a time the most expensive blue gemstone on the planet many moons ago and what a beauty it is stunning lapis lazuli natural oh yes now that is important because it means that it is from that primary source you get the most beautiful blues from the primary source can i just tell you how amazing this strand is. Look at the pyrite. Look at the golden sparkle running through the midnights. It is beautiful. Really, and I've not seen a strand of lapis lazuli like this actually. I've seen some stunning cabochons. I've seen some really lovely drops. I've seen some irregular, um, almost sort of, um, sort of uh, I would say almost nugget sizes if you like. These, really beautiful and so stunningly polished. They've got a really high glossy finish to them, haven't they? They almost look wet, don't they? They do. So, they look uh, as if they're soaking, so literally, because that, that gloss 
almost as if there's a coating on there. I can guarantee you yeah. there is not a coating on this. There is a genuine, natural and enhanced strand. That's the level of the quality of your pyrite. And the reason I wanted to say that is because you see all those little moments of the pyrite running through. It's absolutely extraordinary how powerful the golden spot is of the pyrite running through those deeper and more sort of regal blues. Lovely quality. Um, totally natural, don't get me wrong, the entire jewellery world will play around with your lapis lazuli. Sometimes it comes out of the ground. I'm going to show you actually, let me show you a little moment of it. See this one here? That looks a little bit like so delight, doesn't it? Can you mm. see the lapis lazuli? You've got a gorgeous sort of uh, regal blue. Gosh, that's like the DreamWorks symbol. You almost expect oh, yes. that. Sorry, something just... <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh, God. And so it begins. Anyway, as I say, do you see that DreamWorks, that sort of cloud that comes across? Now, the reason I wanted to show you this is because... <laughs> um, what normally would happen is you'd take the lapis lazuli and then you'd dye it to get rid of the mica inclusion that's kind of running through it. And that would be an enhanced moment of lapis lazuli. But as you can see, it's a totally unenhanced strand. We've left it au naturel. You've got the cobalt blues, you've got the commodore blues, you've got the most amazing midnight blues and regal blues. And of course, you've got that lovely patterned moment of the pyrite running through it totally naturally. And all you're paying, all you're paying is six ninety five. Amazing value tonight. Um, 55 carats of unenhanced premium source, primary source. What does that mean? It means that it's taken from the mountains rather than the riverbeds. The mountains of where it would have originated and formed before it cascaded down to the riverbeds. That's what we're talking about when we talk about primary source. And the majority of the world's primary source comes from the mountain regions of Afghanistan. There are other places in the world, of course, that produce beautiful lapis lazuli. But this body of colour and this amount of pyrite, can you see how strong it is? It's an amazing price for $6.95, isn't it? Stunning strong colour, really, really is. I think you're going to love that. I think you're going to love the glossy quality of it as well. Mm. Hi, Collectors in West Midlands. Hi, Cheryl. Hi, Helen and Chris. Hi, Lynn. Hi, Susanna. Great to see you. Hello, Kim. New call as well done indeed. Now, we are going to open our second kit for pre-order. Lots of you have asked if that's possible. Um, look, there's only 75, so we were reminiscing about whether or not we were going to do that for you. Um, we had to kind of think about it because, um, obviously, the first kit that we had, it flew. It just flew out the door before we had even got to the actual opportunity for you. So... With only 75, I do this with a little bit of trepidation, if I'm being honest with you, but lots of you have asked if you can get your hands on the second kit um, before the opportunity, so we'll do it for you. You get a strand of tanzanite, you get a the cabochon of the tanzanite is sensational. That on the back of the hand for you so you get a chance to see it. Look at that, doesn't that just have the most amazing violet blue glow? Then, strand of what I would refer to as rice pearls, beautiful quality, stunning pearlescence, and so, so feminine and dainty and pretty. And then, two reels of your pearl colour round copper wire. You're getting a 0.4 and a 0.8. 10 metres of each. Okay, so that is the second kit. It's available for pre-order now. Let me show you the jewellery that Debs has put together for us. The necklace is a wow, wow, wow. Beautiful earrings. Look at the cabochon. Oh my gosh, that stunning <laughs> amount of your... Is that, what we, is that rosary link? Yes. That's what we call a rosary. Yes. Thank you. I just wanted to double check yeah. that as well on that one. Um, it is, it, what you've done with the pearls and the tanzanite is, st I love it. It took me a while. <laughs> I'm not surprised. I, I'm not surprised. And we, we, you know, some of the chain that we bring, yes, yes. the solid selling silver chain with the pearls through it, that task is done for you I already, know. isn't it? It they, takes the work out of it, obviously. They're wonderful. But, absolutely incredible to get those. 
Gorgeous, and yeah. it looks amazing, I have to say. Thank you. Do you enjoy ro doing a oh, rosary I chain? Love I, rosary I would Lincoln. imagine when you see it all come together, that for me, I can imagine being very satisfactory. Yeah, yeah it is. I gorgeous, love it. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Okie dokie. Um, listen, make sure that you're pre ordering on that. Please do. We've only got 75, less than 75 now. You're already buying it. Brilliant, brilliant. Um, you ready for some on and gone? Okay, good. Delving in to box number four. This is your Aventurine drilled pendant donut oh i love donuts they're good <laughs> <laughs> in in that stands as well love yeah. the donut <laughs> <laughs> a bit of simpsons there right homer in the corner <laughs> Two ninety five. Donuts and beer. Beautiful. <laughs> Thank you for saying that tomorrow. Uh, oh, well. You're adventuring. <laughs> beautifully glossy. You've got the drill hole at the top there. Lovely size. You've got that lovely, puffy, beautiful quality to this. I love that the, the actual drill hole isn't dead centre. I love that you've got that off centre. I think for jewellery for gents, this is going to be absolutely fantastic. It's also two ninety five. That is it for an 18 millimeter beauty. Eight carats in total. It's on, it's gone. Please do make sure you're checking out. 2.95. Do you know, you could Good, make a it? really nice cocktail ring with that and prong set it like I did yeah. with a heart. Absolutely. And, and that would just look so contemporary it, it, yeah, absolutely. and unusual really would. with it yeah. offset. If you've got mm. your cord and your leather, obviously it's that. Yeah, I mean, that's I'm, super simple. We've talked about this, so the cows come yeah. home because we had these uh, amazing under £10 day. Uh, 2.95. For that beautiful, ready polished, ready smooth, good to go at two ninety five. Now, Venturine, if you don't understand your sort of your, your, your sort of passion behind Venturine, well, you've got to remember it's a beautifully durable gemstone. Really, is a beauty to work with, and it has that jade look to it, doesn't it? Yeah. It does have that appeal? Yeah. Two ninety five. Yeah, it is indeed. Yeah. It is indeed. 295 on your screen. Bad. You're checking that out as well, which is lovely to see. It's on, it's gone. I'm not surprised at 295. A multi buy situation going on in California, Greater Manchester, Essex, Pennsylvania, Worcestershire. If you all check out, that, that literally flies out the door and it's gone. Good luck. Good luck. Moving on then to How Light, same design. This time around, those beautiful pastel greys, soft greys running through. The snow white. It is beautiful. It does look like marble, but it has such a Ooh, well, stunning like rarity. It's nice, isn't it? Yeah. Really, really nice. <laughs> got to say, and, and I've talked about this a lot, but my brother's got this, um, he's got a, a leather wrist wrap with just like one silver bead on it. And he said, have you got mm. anything I can pop on there? I was like, yep. Yes. Per just yeah. perfect. Yeah. Perfect. 2 on your screen. Beautifully polished. Lovely, smooth, high polish finish. I and love those greys. I do as well. It's lovely, it, isn't it? Again, that's a really classic look, isn't mm, it? The, mm, the grey mm, and the white. Yeah. But I love the way the um, the drill hole through the yeah the, the centre. Well, it's not through the centre, but off centre. Th that's yeah, right. Yeah. Through the off centre. <laughs> <laughs> through the door, isn't it? <laughs> is is straight edged. It's yes, not, it is. It's not curved in, yeah. so it's really crisp looking. It's a very sharp edge very sharp, to it, and yeah. it's lovely. Yeah. Really lovely. Two ninety five on your screen. Again, beautiful, genuine gems. And I love the thickness of that as well. Yeah. Really lovely. Love the fact that you can follow the pattern all the way through that piece because the matrix marking that runs through a highlight mm. is all natural and genuine. That is an absolute beauty for two ninety five. Hi to Lena, Cumbria, Sarah, Tracy, Janet, so many of you there. Hold the lines, talk to the call centre. Now we stay with the same shape, the same design, but we move to the snowflake. Now this is going to be very appealing, I would imagine, for those of you who love your monochromes. Dappled greys and jet ebony, very glossy background. 18 millimetres again. Everything that we've said about the Aventurine and the Howlight Still, the design lends itself so beautifully. You can see as well, it's just got that lovely dip into the centre and then, of course, that off-centre drill hole. Have you still got the multicoloured tourmaline there? I do indeed, love. That would look really lovely with that. That would work really well. I do you indeed. Could, you could actually then have um, sort of the tourmaline, all the different colours coming around the neck 
and then have a chain yeah. and tourmaline tassel coming off the Beautiful. bottom of the donut. Oh, now she's mentioned the word tassel, and that makes tassel. my ears prick up and take notice. Mm. Now, because I like tassels in jewellery. I love tassels. I adore them. Yeah. Honestly, I'm a little bit tassel obsessed. Yeah, me too. But yes. <laughs> I love the idea of a tassel coming off this. Could hang it this way, couldn't you then? Yeah. Little jump ring off through yeah. through there. Then the tassel. Oh yes, Debs, love yep. it. Two ninety five. And of course the. Can you remind me what the price of the tourmaline was, please, um, Phil? Seven ninety five, love. Seven ninety five. Thank you. Seven ninety five for the tourmaline. If you want to add that to your order. Last of stock on this one. Do make sure you're checking it out. You've got just over 15 minutes until the abalone heart. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Looking forward to that very much indeed. Hold those lines well done on and gone. Okay, we're moving then on to... Now, these are your rough silver diamond nuggets. Oh my gosh, these are really large. I've not seen such large nuggets of uh, rough diamond. Have a look at these. Is there something weird about the way that I say nugget? Nugget. I'm just, no, I know. I just, I'm just, I'm just wondering what it is. Is it like nugget. omelet? Oh. Omelet. Yeah. Apparently, I've got to say omelet. It's, it's a Gavin and Stacey thing. You, omelet. you do say your teas. I don't. They're clipped. Hmm. Mm. Okay. That's fine. Just wondered. Because every time I say nugget, I get a little titter and a giggle from in the gallery, and, and then Paul goes, "I like the way you say that." I don't. Know. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> We've known each other a long time, Paul. <laughs> that was so wrong. Oh. <laughs> Paul just went, Paul just went, just say nugget to me. Everybody just texting the word nugget to Paul right now. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, honestly. <laughs> Rough silver diamonds. Look at the size of these. They are just, look at that surface luster. Can you see it? Right, let me show you these. Six strands left. But they are some of the largest sizes that we've seen. Can you see that beautiful isometric sparkle? They are really beautifully fiery. They've got scintillation. Look at that. Lovely size rough nuggets that you're getting here. Twenty-one ninety-five on your screen. The last six strands, eight carats that we're getting here. California, Greater London, Anonymous Collectors. Phil's just said that these look like sexy meteors. This is true. They do look like se sexy meteors. That's a really... They do. They do, Phil. They do. <laughs> they do look like... <laughs> oh, come on, no. I was very clear about... I can't win tonight, Dad. I don't think so, no. I can't win. I don't I know really... what they've been drinking I in said there, but... They do look like... Sexy meteors. Not that I like a sexy meteor. That's just weird. <laughs> so like, what? What do you like? No. They look like. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what's going on tonight now? Come it's on now. It's only quarter past eight. <laughs> I know. Honestly. We're having such a lovely time. Uh, 21 95 <laughs> on your screen. Please do me. <laughs> Oh, anyhow, there's one strand left. You're all wonderful at home putting up with us. You really, really are wonderful. Send in your nuggets <laughs> to fill in to Paul in the gallery. That's Keep all down. Well done. Moving on. Um, <laughs> next one. Yes. Okay, we had some beautiful pyrite on the longest strand for you earlier, but. Oh. These have got a really, these are four to six millimetres on the graduation. The other strand we had was five to six. Peruvian again. And I have to say, I'm very impressed with that surface. Mm. Really impressed. Yeah, it's, 
They almost look like little ball bearings. Absolutely, they look as if they could be as part of our findings kit. Mm. Yeah, they yeah. really do. Like your uh, sort of your, your brass beads or something yeah. like that. Absolutely, they really do. They've got the most gorgeous, gorgeous metallic luster. They really, really have. 90 carats of golden colour pyrite, graduated plain rounds, four to six millimetres on a 22 centimetre strand. All natural. All natural. Now, let me measure the strand length for you. It says 22. Just double checking that strand length. Mm -hmm. mm. So I've got 24 there. So you're getting a little bit longer there. 24 centimetres. Um, and that's not including the lovely tassels. Uh, 4 95 Under £5. Pounds. It's a great price, isn't it? How much was the other one? I think it was Which... 7 7 Yeah, 7 95 for the other strand. Wow. Slightly longer and slightly larger on bigger. that graduation. Yeah. yeah. Under five pounds for the entire strand though. Absolutely gorgeous. The metallic luster that you're getting from that pyrite is amazing. 90 carats. And just to reiterate the graduation on this strand is four to six millimetres for your plane rounds. Drill hole looks a really generous size on mm. these as well. Four but ninety-five. Buying um, both strands and combining them. Look at you, <laughs> oh, that's it now. Oh, I, right, Paul. Yeah. How many years? How Nuggety many years have we known each other? We met each other what? Two thousand. Just started two thousand and nine. I think it was. So we've known each other a long time now. You got a new nickname. <laughs> All right, then, Nuggety Nugget Face. <laughs> 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 I'm quite happy to see it. <laughs> All those T's. He need, needs it as his ringtone on his phone. <laughs> Calling Nuggety Nuggets. Oh, we've got to move on. Oh, Sally, that has proper tickled me. It really, really has. Brilliant. I love that you get involved in your show. I really, really do. I love it. For those of you sat at home going, I, I know. <laughs> I know. I know. For those of you who watch regularly, well done. <laughs> right. We've got these are fabulous, really fabulous. Just the most. Um, I've got to say, this has such quality to it. Wow. Now, obviously, we're doing our colourways tonight, and this definitely sits in our purples to our blues, isn't it? Yeah. Beautifully, beautifully. That would work so well with. The second kit coming up. Yeah. Oh, well, and the first kit as well, because those yeah. colours. Yeah. I see an eggplant in there somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> I see a beautiful purple orchid. A bit of amethyst. A <laughs> yeah. bit of Silver lined lavender. Orchid. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, Absolutely. No, no, in all seriousness, though, 98 carats of faceted beauties. Um, we've got 15 strands left available for you. It will be on and gone. Wait until you see the price on this. This is outstanding. Now, I know that you're excited with the price of under £15 for the quality and the saturation and the brilliance, but it is the last of stock and we're going to do everything we can on price. The last 14 strands, first one's already gone. Well, well done, Collector in London. And Norfolk. Yep, you're there, County Durham. Ten ninety five just for your on and gone deal for you tonight. Now, nothing's changed since it was 15 pounds. You're still getting great Alto Uruguayan Brazilian pink amethysts. You're still getting beautiful faceting. You're still getting amazing tone and saturation. You're still getting fantastic brilliance. It's absolutely on the, mar on the money, I would say, at 15 pounds. 10.95, everything we can for you on the last of stock. Graduated on four, by, uh, four to two to nine by four on those beautiful faceted rondelles. They are beautifully big, big, big faceted mm. rondelles, aren't they? Yeah, they are. Really nice, because that means you can see all of the faceting. Mm, definitely. And, and there's enough there to be able to expect, but you're not gonna shroud that gemstone because of the size of them. Mm -hmm. Loads of light's gonna get into yeah, them, isn't it? Yeah, definitely. They're gonna but, bring that brilliance. And again, this is one that I would instantly want to uh, do rosary links with little sections of chain between because then the light really oh can my gosh, get yeah, in and it's we, got a lot of movement. And they move around, not yeah. just sparkling as yeah. in sort of rotate, but literally they will rotate yeah. on that, um, that rosary will. link as well. 
Yeah. Make sure that you're checking out. Please awesome. do. Um, this is from uh, Mavina. He says, uh, so, uh, so he likes the way you move. He likes the way you say your teeth, but most of all, he likes the way you <laughs> move. with me again. I love working with you, right? Okay, that's all right then. Are we still mates? Okay, just checking. <laughs> Nuggety nugget face. <laughs> <laughs> Stop by and for your next Phil's going home. Uh, don't go anywhere. Fantastic start by. Hi, Elizabeth. Hi to Binnis and Kent and Winifred and Anonymous Collections. Last chance opportunity on that one. Brand new pink opal up next. This colour is absolutely fantastic. What an amazing strand. Not only, not only is the colour phenomenal, the translucency, the opacity of these opals, mesmerising. Oh my gosh. Okay, this is, I, I'm going to be very, very honest with you. Right, when I first saw the strand, because of the diaphanity of the opal, I instantly assumed that it was... Ethiopian because of the diaphanity of it, because of the clarity and the translucency in the opal. And then I thought that it was rainbow coloured Ethiopian opal, which means that it would be enhanced, it would be dyed. I am absolutely over the moon to tell you that this diaphanity comes to you from the base of the Andes Mountains in Peru, and that this colour and that this diaphanity is totally unenhanced. That's amazing absolutely amazing now look you've got that beautiful 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 plain square graduated strand and obviously we get a chance to see all those beautiful sides of the opal exposed the body of color the translucency but I am going to do for you right now though is just show you as well if I grab just separate those opals and just show you can you see Look at that translucency. It's almost oh, calcedony like. It's so yes, translucent. It is. Isn't yeah, that amazing? That is. I've not seen opal with that much colour and that much translucent it's quality. A, certainly not from Peru. Normally no. it's opaque. Yes. But it has got the most absolutely outstanding body of colour. Now, I love the fact that you can work with it like this, but Debs, how no. would we, just out of interest, because of the, the mm -hmm. colours that we've got in our first kit that sold out, yes. how would we be uh, sort of maybe attaching a seed bead so that we could see that full square mm -hmm. shape there well, and then popping the seed bead on the top so that it hides the hole and you can sort of, yeah. Um, if, so you're, you've almost got it like a button. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. almost well, sort of cufflink like. You, yeah. yeah, if you use a head pin mm -hmm. and pop it through one of your seed beads yeah. and then through the gemstone, you can do a little wrapped loop at the bottom. That would be fab. Because then if you did that, you could um, attach it onto a necklace and have lots of layers going well, that's on. Well, I'm thinking because it's, you, it's lovely to see those four sides of the square yeah. because they're, yeah. so, they're a lovely size. Definitely. But actually, if you wanted to rotate it and see the full face on the flat part mm -hmm. of that, it looks amazing to see it. The colours yeah. are mesmerising. Absolutely beautiful, beautiful, beautiful look. You could tessellate these, couldn't yeah, you, as well? Yeah, you could. If you, um, if you sort of stitch over and through, you could yeah. almost basically oh stitch them together. <laughs> Is that flying again? <laughs> he was here before. He was in yeah. fly bombing you as well. Yeah. Honestly. I think he sat on Emma's head earlier. Oh, oh. What? It's gross. This fly just keeps dive bombing us in the studio. It's ridiculous. Anyway, moving on. Um, so, what I would say to you is, as we were just saying, it's, is this a, did you say this is a brand new strand film? It's an absolutely beautiful one. It works so well mm. with our colours that we've been, I've never ever seen it so translucent, which is very, very exciting if we're a gemstone lover like I am, like Debs is, and of course, like yeah. most of us are here at Jewelry Maker. Um, 53 carats. Their size, they're three to seven mil, seven ninety-five. <laughs> for those, for this colour 
and for this translucency. One of my favourite things to oh, do with gorgeous. this um, sort of slab, this yeah. slice of gemstone, is to um, re-thread it on beading thread. Yeah but put a crimp tube in between each gemstone and it looks like you've got a metal chain almost oh, running wow. through the yeah. centre yeah. and you've got all of the the sides that you can see then. Gorgeous, really gorgeous. Mm. Um, from Sally who says, uh, pink fish scales, <laughs> perfect. Ah, oh, yeah! For the beautiful mermaid. Wow. Yeah. There's, do you know, on your hand yeah. from here i can see a really vibrant almost salmon pink it, it's amazing isn't it color it is i think that if you only get one of these strands i think that you'd be a little bit disappointed i think you're going to need yeah. two the light working with that that gemstone is amazing you can see it's yeah, just yeah. the most beautiful beautiful translucency can you understand why when i first looked at the strand i was thinking to yes. myself ethiopian dyed opal yeah because definitely. that is how we'd work with ethiopian opal yeah. yes you'd get the diaphanity but you'd have to dye it to get this color yeah. peruvian opal is normally very very opaque it is a lovely ballet slipper pink color but yeah. not that diaphanity that's mesmerizing to it's, see it, it reminds me of um you know the pink sugar mice Oh, it's yeah, got, yeah, that yeah. Sort it's got that real sort of sugary pink the, colour. Yeah. Mm. Whereas this, it's got a glow to it. Definitely. A life to it. Um, loads of you there. So good to see you tonight. Uh, well done to uh, Brent, to Kirsty, uh, collectors in Greater London, to Taryn, to Helen, to Anne Marie, to collectors in Cumbria, to Shaleen, to anonymous collectors. You're there. Um, hold the lines. It's time for our must have. Of course, that is the fabulous, fabulous abalone heart that Debs has just worked a magic with. I will show you this in a matter of moments, but it is tonight's must have. It's already half past eight. My goodness me, where is the time going? Half Half an hour until we have our second kit with Debs, of course, is available for pre-order. You can get your hands on that, of course, before it sells out. We have less than 50 left. Good luck. Next, though, it's tonight's must have. This is such a fabulous gemstone. I know we set a challenge for Debs to... Uh, to just work her magic with this. And she has very, very elegantly just wire wrapped, really simple open wire wrap as well because you can see how exposed that is. Look at the colours! Now, of course, we are celebrating a colourway. We've celebrated beautiful purples and pinks to start off with. We're moving on to the blues in our second kit with Debs in half an hour's time. So to transition from those beautiful purples and pinks, we're travelling through turquoises, indigos, violets, shimmering baby pink colours, little soft moments of gold, iolite, tanzanite colour, all the way through to the nine o'clock kit, of course, which brings us those violetish blues of the tanzanite. It's a great transition of colour, isn't it, for it a colourway day? Yeah, it is. And it, it always, I just find it mesmerising, the way that mm, the definitely. colours change across the surface. And it, you... It, if you change the angle that you're looking at it yeah. and also change the angle that you're holding it at, you get totally different effects all see. the time, all the way round. It just, it's mesmerising. Look at that, that's like is, literally neon. Yeah. Like that neon looks as if it's actually raised. Yeah. This part here, this little, almost like a little sort of Tahitian island, looks as if it, that looks like something out of Moana. <laughs> <laughs> if you've not seen it, you don't know what I'm talking about. The Moana Disney film. Go and see it, it's amazing. Um, but it is, I'm a big Disney fan. Um, but you see, it looks like an, a beautiful island in the middle. Yeah. A translucent Indian Ocean, incredible cut. It's mesmerizing. I love it, absolutely love it. And you are as well. And the price on the web, you're not paying. So for everybody who has got excited about that, we're going to take that a little bit lower for you. Now, obviously, you're just getting that beautiful abalone heart. Uh, you, of course, will be able to work your own magic with that. That is just a very sort of quick, fabulous little challenge that we gave to, uh, of course, to Debs earlier. Um, you could obviously, absolutely, you can see how that would work as a ring, though, couldn't you? Prime yeah. setting. Yeah. A little bit of wire wrapping for the shank, and you're good to go. Four ninety-five, under five pounds. Isn't that fabulous? And it's got that slight 3D puffiness to it. Yes. Now, I don't want to take it out of the setting um, to show everybody. Shall I pop it would out? Would you it's, mind? No, it's fine. Thank, please, darling. I don't yeah. want to ruin it. If you would do it, sweetheart, just no, so I can it's... show everybody that, um, just so I can show everybody that puffy heart. 
Because it's not a flat disc, no, is it? It's got that no. lovely... Thank you, sweetheart. That's all right. It's got that lovely... Can you see that lovely density, that thickness to it? You see that either side, just amazing. Make sure that you're dialing and confirming. Now, I would say, if you want to multi-buy, this is the time to do it. And just to give you an idea, obviously, you've got the sizes on your screen, which say it's approximately 30 millimetres. If I just pop that on the hand, you'll get an idea of that three centimetre drop from the top to the bottom. It is gorgeous, isn't it? Now, every single one of them is going to be individual and it's going to be unique. That is really really important none of them not one of them will ever be identical ever it's totally unenhanced it's totally natural absolutely every little moment of that beautiful color that you are getting there is all 100 natural this beautiful radiance this sensational palescence the iridescence which is part of the family of phenomena of gemstones all of that is totally and utterly and enhance. I think that's so important. Don't you know that? It's a huge look, mind, isn't it? Look at that. Just like Debs was saying a second ago, every angle that you view it, you see a different moment of the colour. There's almost a toyancy happening there as well. Can you mm. see where that sort of almost cat's eye effect of the colour is coming together in the iridescence? It's absolutely awesome, isn't it? I find it quite hard to work with pieces like this, though. Why is that? Um, because I can't decide which, which side, side you want to work I want with. to work with. Mm. which is why when I did the, the pendant mm. mount there, I left it really open yeah. at the back so you can see yeah, yeah. all the way around. It's a great idea. Um, with the black pearls, oh, oh, yum. Definitely. The black pearls that we had for you at the end of the kit, mm. oh, oh, yeah. Be they Becky would... tidied, tidied yeah, up. Yeah, she's very she efficient. She was a good girl. She's yeah. very efficient. Just she's like tidied that. away. Um, but, yeah, they would, actually, really, really would. Make sure that you're holding those lines. Amazing, amazing deal. Congratulations on that one. That is a beaut. It really is. It's very um, tactile. It is, just isn't it? holding it. Mm. Yeah, yeah, it's nice. Amazing to think that that's been in the oceans yeah. in fresh water pearl. Yeah. It's just amazing. Um, well done. Yeah, of course we can. This is very, is that all? This is really pretty. Oh, I adore these. I've got got a little Have collection you? at home. Have you yet? worked with them yet? Or are you just no, kind of I'm waiting? To, when I get a minute, I'm going to make. Some, <laughs> no. I'm going to make Honestly, myself a bracelet. That's bracer. the second time you've intimated that you might be a bit busy at the minute. I'm I don't know doing what. Do you know lots of jewelry? <laughs> I'm going. I might do that this weekend. What, make treat myself. Yourself, make yourself some earrings. Something. Yeah. Okay, it's just so, tangled. So bear with me two seconds. Pair of earrings. Thanks, sweetheart. And then um, so a bracelet. That's what I'm going to do with mine. Did you multi buy? I did. Yeah. Good girl. Different I think sizes. You need to. I yep. think you need to. Now. Yep. Two weeks ago, this premiered. We how many did we say, say again, Phil? How many did we? One hundred and forty. And I've got the last nine. It's very pretty. It's really, really pretty. This is a very dainty daisy chain, isn't it? Mm, very, very lovely. delicate. Very, very pretty. I'm going to hold it up to the neckline for you, just so you get a chance to see how that's going to look. Now we've got nine left. 2.9, sorry, 2.8 grams of solid sterling silver. You've got 40 centimetre chain, six millimetres, and you've got a, a very pretty amount of silver coming through here. Now, I'm just taking it to the neckline just to kind of give you an idea of the size of those gorgeous, pretty daisies, and yellow gold overlay in the centre. In a heart, would, would you, I would wear this every single day mm -hmm. it's so pretty yeah it is oh it's so my it my friend penny got married gosh it would be nearly 10 years ago almost now and had the big margarita um big daisies oh, as her yes. bouquet yeah. and in sort of oh, the decoration that... she that is her <gasps> favorite flower she would fall over herself to wear something like this mm. every day very very pretty the last nine. Next time this comes into stock, I'm definitely going to buy one of these so I can make her a necklace. She would love That's that. That's a really nice idea. Mm, mm, mm. Yeah. Fourteen it's be ninety. Really special, isn't it? Beautiful. Yeah. And you've got so many um, flowers on there. Yeah. That you can actually you can take two or three off for okay. a bracelet and earrings, and still have enough for a necklace yeah. because connect it with um, a couple of jump rings onto another 
piece of chain going around the back yeah. of the neck and then you've got the flowers all at the front they're beautiful yeah they're so, so oh, it's, it's such a pretty fantastic pretty, pretty length of chain um we had 140 fly out the door we had the last nine for you tonight when they're gone they're gone you know and there is no guarantee there is no guarantee how quickly these will be back in stock but it is just Perfect. Um, hi to Donna. Hi, Samantha. Hi, Clex in London. Hi to Rosie. Hi to Clex in Cumbria. I've got the very, 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 very last, what, I think three strands of this solid stunning silver chain. 40 centimetres. And, of course, you can, it is very beautiful daisy. Day. Very delicate petals with the gold overlay in the centre. Clex in Cumbria, you're so close. A couple of you on the phone lines waiting to check out. Hold those lines. Oh, that is a definite must-have, that is. <laughs> really, really pretty. Really pretty. Can indeed, yeah. Now, this is lovely. This is a patterned... Um, actually, this is a... What is this? 1.5 millimetre. That's nice to see. Oh, That's I really love substantial. Yeah. Now, I'm just going to unwind just, just quickly. I'm going to hold that in place there. Oh, don't all unravel on me. <laughs> I there love we the go. noise I just, it makes Yeah, as well. I just wanted to show you... The pattern. That's a lovely texturized pattern on it. It's very, very lovely. This is silver plated oh. rose gold colored damask patterned copper wire. So you've got the silver plating in the rose gold color. You've got the beautiful damask pattern. You've got a 1.5 uh, millimeter gauge, five meters in length. And last the stock on this one. Talk to me about a 1.5 mm. millimeter wire, Debs. What, what yeah. would we be, what's the what's the sort of it's, it's very very structured i can feel that it already is, yeah. super strong yeah so if you're making <coughs> um, a framework yeah say a necklace or a bangle or something okay. then it's going to hold its shape really well okay um if you're using a, a finer gauge so a 0.8 or a 0.6 yeah. uh you'll probably need multiple strands to okay. get that same strength mm -hmm. um but it's this, got a really lovely rigidity to it. Yeah, you, know, you can really tell it's good. quite substantial. Really good. So um, what you can do is create really, I suppose, contemporary clean lines mm -hmm. with this that you might not be able to do with okay. some of the finer gauges. Because you've got less of a kink, I'm supposing. Yeah. Because of the le less ma less ma it is malleable, but it's less malleability just from your fingers from working with it. Yeah, it, it just means that it holds the shape that mm, you put it into, mm. so you don't need additional wires to be supporting okay. a frame. Fab stuff. And also, you can use it to make rings with just maybe um, two inches of wire. Okay. And wrap it round. It takes about a minute. Oh, wow. Okay. Um, so, really, really nice for that sort of okay, thing as well. Okay, fabulous stuff. Fab, fab, fab. 11 95 on your screen. Five meters rose gold plating on top of your copper wire. Isn't that amazing? Very, very last of stock on this one. I'm going to wind it back up, <laughs> she says. <laughs> mm. Before, of course, it all uncurls. Oh, gosh. Mm. Um, can ah. this be, can this wire be hammered? Yes. This is from our fabulous Sunlin over in uh, California. What yes. Can, yes. You definitely can. Um, you'll obviously change the pattern that's on the wire yeah um and give more of a hammered look to yeah. it but yeah it can be hammered there's no problem with that at all okay Liz and Kent's message as well um I was playing with the chain oh the daisy chain there we go I was playing with this chain today and wiring oh. out how I could add little bee charms yeah gorgeous um so pretty yeah absolutely amazing deal on that one um now I've unraveled this and now it won't go back do you want me to do it if I let go of that, it's going to be one of those moments where it just yeah. uncoils. <laughs> Everybody, watch your eyes. <laughs> uh, so pretty and great price, says Liz, about the daisy chain. Um, thank you, Silent. And yes, it can be hammered, my darling. It can indeed. Right, cracking on with... Yeah, we have. Those of you who love your pre-night. Again, such a lovely gemstone to work with. Some gorgeous colour here. Um, very, very last of stock on this one for you. On and gone. 50 carats of pre-night. Four millimetres. And oh, under four pounds. That's going to be a deal and a half, isn't it? Mm, nice. Very, very lovely 
gorgeous colours would work so well with the lilacs and the pinks that we've seen already. I'm just going to bring in the pinks of that opal strand that we saw. Such contrasting, gorgeous colour. Three ninety-five on your screen. Fifty carats of beautiful pre-night rounds. And you've got that beautiful moment of the soft grape green, the melon colour. It's a proper beautiful sort of uh, summer colour this is. Bright mint greens coming through there as well. And such a lovely easy gemstone to work with. Fiber baskets not checked out as yet. $3.95. Uh, this is from, oh, anonymous customer. He says, pre-night would look good with the bare copper. Mmm. Mm. Oh, have you? Okay, so Wednesday, you've got a bare copper showcase. 7 p.m. So you've got sheets. You've got, is that with lovely, is that with Laura Binding? Um, Katie Parker as well. Fabulous stuff. Laura did say that she was in for uh, some lovely bare copper, I think, in the next few days. Fab stuff. And you've got Katie Parker with you then as well, late on Wednesday night. Make sure you join us. Well done. Fab stuff. Moving on to... Now, these are... Okay, so... These are the little jute bags. Now, I'm going to mention to Paul Iron Fairies. Do you remember Iron, Iron Fairies. Fairies? Do you remember them? Okay, so Iron Fairies, we had this many, many moons ago mm -hmm. um, uh, at Gemporia. We bought, so the owners now bought out the previous owners and the previous owners mm -hmm. had sort of gone down the route of sort of costume jewellery and sort of little trinkets and we had these things called Iron Fairies. Now I, right. bought, I bought my nieces loads of them because they were into fairies and they were gorgeous to have at the bottom of the garden. But they came in these sort of very, very sort of um, little jute bags and they, I've just seen these and it's just taken me back about sort of 10 years. <laughs> um, but you get the string as well, you get such a lovely rustic look with these. Four little gift bags to present your jewellery. Yeah. I've got to say, they're so. St I love the fact that they're so neutral. Yes, they are. You know, yeah. they just is. They're a timeless gift bag, aren't they? they when I say mm -hmm. that, I mean they're not sort of like a black satin or a sort of you know. They're they're just a lovely timeless. Yeah. Little gift bag. They are. Have you got sizes of these? No, let's give them a measure then. So you've got. So they are uh, 14 centimetres, 14 by 10, thanks Phil, 14 by 10, you get 10 of them and of course they all come with their, uh, their little string of course which you just insert inside here and then of course you've got the little drawstring bag that you can just do up like so as well. But for your gift bags I think to sort of take your jewellery to the next level maybe to present and especially if you're working with bare copper just like Phil was saying you've got a show with it on, uh, on uh, of course Wednesday night your bare copper or maybe your sort of your rose uh, co your rose colour wire um, yeah. all of that sort of all of your wire work they look great really they organic would. pieces of jewellery yeah. free form jewellery would look great presented in these gift bags wouldn't they? They would. And you can screen print onto them. You yeah, can absolutely. Embroider onto yeah. them, all sorts. So. Yeah, absolutely. A yeah. great idea. Um, Seven ninety-five that you're getting there for the ten. Seven ninety-five. So what's that? Seventy-nine pence each. That's mm. good, isn't it? I'm not being funny. Yeah. If I go into my local, my local super, uh, supermarket is the one beginning with a W. Mm -hmm. It's the most expensive corner shop in the world. Yeah. Um, but, <laughs> but just a paper gift bag from there is £3.50. <gasps> so these are that lovely jute. 79 pence. There. And Denise, Gillian, Lena, collectors who want to remain anonymous. Absolutely. Multi-buying going on as well. I think it's a really, really nice idea to present your jewellery in, in, and also yeah. maybe not necessarily in a box but to give that sort of authentic rustic feel to it. 
I yeah. think it's nice, really nice. I mean, it's, it's really useful for people to be able to keep the jewellery in yeah, at home as well. Nice to be able to gift um, it like this yeah. as well. You know yeah. the um, the luggage tags? Yes. You could just attach, just uh, oh, attach a luggage nice. tag on yeah. there. Maybe at Christmas, maybe with a little bit of silver or sort of gold mm. marker pen, sort of with yeah. names on it. Even maybe Christmas Day, sit if you've got sort of a sort of a rustic sort of Scandinavian style Christmas yeah, decor going nice. on, and you've just got that maybe with the instead of crack instead of Christmas crackers with a little gift in it on the table. Yeah. Check Reusable. us out with all the ideas Reusable for Christmas. As well. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> I did mention Christmas. Phil just went. It's not. It's not December yet. You're going to get some coal. I'm sure I've got a Christmas show coming up soon. There is a Christmas show. It's 174 days till Christmas. <laughs> My husband and I were going through the diaries, you know, sort of you know, scheduling things as you do. Yeah. Um, he works ridiculous shifts and I'm away mm. a lot. So we sort of, you know, we went out for breakfast this morning. That was nice. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> Literally. <sighs> anyway. Moving on. So, um, and then we were sat down and we go through, and literally, after, it was like, we were in October after only a few sort of flicks of the pages, yeah. and it's like, this is scary. This is scary. I don't know what's happened this year. It's flown, isn't it? Yeah. Absolutely flown. Well done for getting those. Well done. They're going to Kansas, they're going to Kent, they're going to London, they're going to Hampshire. Anonymous collectors, well done. You've got there loads of you there. Well, well done. Moving on to, I like these a lot. Just these on their own. These are gorge. Have a look at this. Solid selling silver. Ooh, look. They are gorgeous, aren't they? Solid selling silver. Floating circle drop earrings. Beautiful. And again, you can see that beautiful workmanship. Now, I spoke to Laura Binding and she was saying that that is a type of chain mail. She couldn't remember the name of it, but... It is a type of chain mail design that you're getting there in those lovely circles of silver. Really lovely. Not Laura Binding, it was lovely Fleur, sorry, it was lovely Fleur who was talking about um, the chain mail the other night. Gorgeous, look. Uh, this from Sue says, Creepy Crawley seemed to gravitate towards you, Ray. What perfume you were wearing? <laughs> to be... To <laughs> <laughs> Older nugget. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> um, I know, Sue. But to be fair, to be fair, mm -hmm. Debs, you did say to me, have you got I your did. insect repellent with you tonight? I asked, yes. You did ask. To be fair, I'm not alone, because Emma's been, you've been dive-bombed by this yeah, fly as well a couple of times. I've seen you like, doing this behind me. <laughs> it's the thing, is when you're on live TV and you see something flying towards your I face. Know, yeah. you, it's... It's not, you're, not, not, <laughs> you're not really expecting it, are you? It's just <laughs> like... <laughs> Trevor McDonald would have just... Would have <laughs> it did just die from you then. Yeah. It did. Oh. See, Trevor McDonald would have just stayed... I'm just... It wouldn't have, it wouldn't have flinched. Wouldn't have flinched. Whereas I'm sort of like... Oh. <laughs> Dive! <laughs> Honestly, Nicholas Mitchell would have never done that. <laughs> Oh, it's 164, you want to get these. They are gorgeous. Three and a half grams of solid stilling silver for you. Lovely long shepherd's hooks. And stunning, sleek aesthetic of your silver. They are gorgeous. Really, really lovely. And again, lovely movement to the silver dances. You can attach more chain on there. Beautiful gemstones, of course. Entirely your prerogative. They look great and contemporary by themselves. 8.95. They are gorgeous. We are minutes away, minutes away from our second kit with the lovely Debs coming up on your tanzanite, your pearls and your cabochons and of course your pearl coloured wire. Make sure that you stay tuned. Uh, we have got for you, yeah we have indeed, got, <laughs> can I really say this carefully, crystal mesh for you next. <laughs> Am I allowed to remove the protective layer? Yes, do it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> On this! <laughs> Is that okay? I'm going to do it anyway. Is that all right? 
Okay. I'm going to do that. I'm being very, very careful. I do <laughs> I'm being very... <laughs> way of asking you for someone to remove their protective layer. <laughs> so, right. Okay, that's better. <laughs> oh, what? Uh, Fancy having to work under these conditions. Do you conditions. know, somebody asked me the other day, how do you just keep a straight face when you told me what some people say in your ear while you're hosting, while you're presenting? How do you, how do you keep a, a straight face? We just, we've just we, not bothered yeah, tonight. We, we've no, just shared we're with not you. Not anymore. We've just shared with you. Now, this is how, I just wanted to show you because, so this is, so you can see. Yeah. Okay, so that is the reverse. Okay, so that's the reverse. There is a protective layer on this at the moment. And what I mean by that is I'm just, gonna, I'm not going to take all of that off, but I'll just show you. Can you see, I can peel back that protective layer, okay? <laughs> then... I'm going to show you, I've removed the protective backing. Oh, I'm in heaven. Can somebody just put a shepherd's hook on that for me? And literally, we will just go out on the town with that cascade just there, shall we? Yeah. Shall we just pop a little jump ring and a shepherd's hook and have that lovely, folding, beautiful... Look at how... Now, remember what um, Deb was saying earlier about that lovely seed bead work, creating... That, yeah, can, say that again. Yeah, of course I can do that. Do you know what? I'm saying I'm going to do that. I'm going to part, right, in that case, Debs, I'm coming <laughs> over to see you. I'm coming over to see you. Come on, let's go. We'll have a, a live little uh, jewellery map. Do you know what I mean by these? Because they're fabulous. Now, well, I am going to ask you to destroy a piece of jewellery. <laughs> if you wouldn't mind. Would you mind? You take the silver shepherd's hooks off those earrings yeah. that we just had. Only because... You know, we were talking earlier about that fluidity of movement, almost material-like. This is amazing. I don't know if you've ever worked with this before. It is stunning. Look at the drape on my hand. Look at the drape on that. What are you going to need, sweetheart? I was just thinking we need the jump ring as well. But... There's nothing like some high-pressure live jewellery making. Now, what I'm going to do... That amazing sparkle. Soldered. Is the jump ring soldered? Yeah. Okay. There is. I'm just going to take that plastic backing. No, I need a jump ring. Okay. Can we get a jump ring, please, Beck? <laughs> I love a little bit I'm of life. A little I'm bit. On of... It. See, she's said she's got there, she's got a kit ready to go. See, this is why you need your stash. These, so the backing comes off really, really easily. So I've just taken that off from there. Now, again, that's all just excess. There's nothing wrong with that. Like, is it totally and utterly solid? Nothing's actually come off that at all. You can see there. You can see the fluidity of movement on the back of that. And just draping those with that crystal is amazing. Now, this is Swarovski Crystal Mesh Silver Brushed Base. So, again... With that lovely background that you can see. Now, obviously, I've just gone sort of basic with this one. Thank you, sweetheart, so, so much. I'll give you that next bit. Now, Des has just popped a jump ring through there. So you can see that lovely square shape folds, that diamond shape folds to create material-like beautiful fold. And that movement's going to be amazing. Now, I don't think I've got any earrings in today, so I'm going to pop it up to the ear for you now and just show you how that is going to look, just so that you can see. Because, check that out. Oh, they look amazing. Oh my gosh, Christmas Ooh. parties. They are beautiful. This is an unplanned <laughs> live demonstration, which I have to say, <laughs> our lovely Debs is just <laughs> stepping up to the challenge as always. But look at that. 16.95 for those beautiful brushed base crystal. That's fab. They are amazing. Thank you, sweetheart. There we go. Very, very, very much indeed. Now, just pop those in. Oh, oh the sparkle's amazing. <laughs> it is. I like a little bit of sparkle. Check those out. 
They're fab. Oh, thank you so much. $16.95. Now, I know that all we've done is just popped a little shepherd's hook on those. Yeah. What are we selling those for? We're not selling Ooh. them for $16.95. I don't think so, no. Absolutely not. They nope. feel amazing. That fluidity of movement. Thank you so much, Debs. Keep it oh, You're welcome. I love a freebie. <laughs> Come to work at a freebie. They're going to be like this now. No, they have to go back in the box. They've got to go back to the warehouse. You've got to you put the sticker on the back. Put the sticker back on the back of them. You're going to have to reattach the shepherd's hooks to those earrings. This is all you, Phil. You can write the email. Yeah. Do make sure that you are checking out. Now, can I double check? We're just getting the one piece for six. You, you are getting, you're getting the pair. Getting so you're getting two. both of them. Oh, that's fantastic. Okay, so that's a pair of beautiful bases there at 16.95. That's fantastic. Absolutely wow. fantastic. Thank you, sweetheart. They're proper Aurora Borealis. I love a live demo. Thank you, sweetheart. <laughs> as You're ever, welcome. just stepping up to it as ever. Thank you, sweetheart. <laughs> Come back. We've only got a few more minutes and we're back with Debs now. Again, just so that you know, a couple more to squeeze. Have we got a chance? Is that it? We've got to go to Kit. Ah. Oh. Okay, so I'll just stay here because I'm no point. I'll be back here in a second for you. So, thank you, sweetheart. Very, very much indeed. Now we're going to see the expertise, of course, from lovely Debs on the cabochoned Tanzanite and our beautiful Tanzanite pearl and pearl coloured wire kit coming up for you in a few moments time. Now we're going to be focusing on that beautiful cabochon. It's a massive, massive carat weight. Beautifully wire wrapped and coming up to you as part of our second kit tonight in our colourway. Now we've seen the pinks, we've seen the purples transitioning now all the way through to those beautiful tanzanite blues and they're all coming your way in our second kit with Debs in a matter of moments. Don't go anywhere, get your questions in about your jewellery making of course to Debs as soon as you possibly can and don't go anywhere and by the way these you <laughs> need, you've got to get them, make sure you're checking those out, they are fabulous. Don't go anywhere, we've got our second kit up with Debs next. Welcome to Jewelry Maker. We are part of the Immediate Media family. Immediate Media is a fast-growing multimedia platform company who operates some of the most loved brands across the UK. Our brands range from our other shopping TV channel, The Sewing Quarter, to our very successful magazines, such as Simply Knitting, Molly Makes, and The Radio Times. We work incredibly hard to inspire you and bring you lots of exciting ideas and projects. So whatever your creative needs, you know that our crafting family will be there for you. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. The Jewelry Maker Wall of Fame is where you get to showcase your skills as a jewelry designer. Each week, one lucky entrant will win £100 credited to their account, and the runner-up receives 50 If you want to enter your design, just send a photo to studio at jewelrymaker.com, or you can post your photos to Jewelry Maker, Ivy House, Henley Road, Outhill, Studley, B807DU. Get making and good luck. Did you know when you book on a Jewelry Maker workshop, you are given exclusive access to our Jewelry Maker shop? You can browse through special items and offers, be privy to selected discounts and deals that you can't get at any other time. Shop whilst you learn and grab yourself some amazing offers. For more information on workshops and available dates, contact our call centre.
well, that's lovely to have your company. I'm not bothered moving. It's no point, because we've got to come right. straight back to Deb's for lovely, lovely, lovely demo. Um, hope you're really well. Welcome to the last hour of The Late Show. It just has, it has flown by. Now, lots of these kits have already flown out the door. We only had 75 to start off with. So we don't have 75 left. Graphics on your screen. Um, and please, please enjoy the size of this cabochon. Um, I think this was, this was sort of the pièce de résistance of the uh, of the kit, wasn't it? Really? Yeah, definitely. It's um, it's just such a beautiful blue, isn't it? Just mm. it's it's very very sizable. Um, what I will say is when you've got a five carat tanzanite oval cab, twelve by nine mil. I need you to put this into perspective, and I need you to just give me your attention for two seconds. There are big, big jewellers out there who class, and what they call this type of tanzanite. Let me explain what I mean by that. So you see that this looks almost like a violet emerald, a violet blue emerald. You know, it's got the silks, it's got the jardins, it's got the inclusions in it. It's got that sort of, uh, sort of semi-opacity to it that you'd get within an emerald. Now, lots of jewellers class this as lavender tanzanite. And there is a very well-known jewellers that springs to mind, very, 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 very high-end jewellers that springs to mind, that works with a one carat lavender emerald in silver and wants 99 pounds. It's a cabochoned one carat tanzanite in silver for 99 pounds. That, that, no, that's up to them. That's okay. That's, that's their prerogative. You've got a five carat tanzanite in this kit. I know you've got beautiful pearl coppered wire in two different gauges, 10 meters both lengths. I know you've got stunning pearls. I know you've got a strand of tanzanite that is gorgeously, gorgeously saturated. But just for the cabochon alone, this kit is amazing. Now, obviously, that is a sizable five carat. It's approximately 12 by nine millimeters. And all of them are going to have that stunning violet blue colour. Love, love, love it. Then we've got for you your beautiful freshwater, colour, uh, freshwater cultured potato pearls, 100% natural. No dyeing, no bleaching, nothing other than natural beauty, 3 by 4 mil on a 38 centimetre strand. And then you have your tanzanites. And the tanzanites, 25 carats. 20, uh, sorry, two to five millimetres on the graduation, 18 centimetre strand. Then you've got the two spools of your pearl coloured round copper wire, 0 0.4, 0 0.8 on those gauges and then 10 metres of each. Now, it is a steel of a kit. For those of you who have de for those of you who have already checked out well done. Say that again for me, Phil. 12 by 9, 12 by 9, just to reiterate, uh, some of you missed the measurement that I gave on the cabochon. 12 by 9 millimeters. Now the price that you're about to see for this kit is one of those moments I think is going to put a smile on your face because we're going under 30. Believe me, this should, this should be, this should be, this entire kit should be closer to 50 pounds. We're taking it to under 30. 27.95. That's a joy to work with that cabochon, isn't it? Yeah, I really enjoyed it because the colour, it's just, it is textbook you, though, isn't it? You just lose yeah. yourself in that yeah. colour. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it it's is gorgeous. It is textbook. Yeah. It is beautiful. And it's a really nice size as well yeah, to work with. Definitely. Because it's solitaire it's, size. It is. Isn't yeah, it? It's solitaire it size. Yeah. You could quite easily make it into a ring. Um, Absolutely. And have a real statement piece. Mm, definitely. At that size. Definitely. It is Fab. gorgeous, really, really is. Um, look, obviously, 
this is going to be one of those kits where you are getting so, well, without a doubt, I think that you're getting so much for your money. I can't even imagine what the people, if you are selling your jewellery, I can't even imagine what you would be selling the five carat tanzanite for in your piece of jewellery. Do <laughs> your research. Research your cabbage and tanzanites. Research your lavender tanzanite. That's what a lot a lot of jewellers call their cabochoned tanzanites, they call it lavender tanzanite. Do your research and see what you'll be paying for elsewhere because honestly, I think it'll blow, you, blow your mind on the price. I really mm. do, really do. Now we're yeah. going to be focusing on the cabochon for the demo with Debs because you can see here how it very classically, classically looks in that rosary uh, cascade. I love that rosary link cascade. It's really, really lovely. The pearls and the tanzanite just work so well together, don't they? They do, yeah. It's really beautiful. The, the size of it, I, and well, just everything about it just mm, works. Definitely. Really, really beautiful. Um, now, you've popped, and I, I know that we're concentrating yeah. on this section here, but you've popped a little sort of almost here. It's a bolt ring. It's, yes, yeah. the bolt ring, so you could... Detach. Detach that off. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Almost choker style necklace then with that one, couldn't you? The shorter length. Actually, you could if you put... I, I put all four of those um, lengths of mm. rosary link in onto one jump yeah. ring and onto the bolt ring, but you could do you it, could just put it that onto, way. Yeah. Because um, the, the necklace section is like standalone, mm. so you can then detach the drop if you want to um, and just wear... A really simple mm, um, definitely. necklace. Good. That's that 16 and, and inches. And on the sister says, beautiful kit. And the cabbage mm. and wrap is so different. I'm looking forward to the demo, Deb. Thank you. That's lovely. We're looking forward to it too. Shall we crack on with Thank it? Thank you. Come on. All over yep. to you. Yep. Now, I gate crashed one of Laura Binding's workshops. Ah, I love it. About six, eight weeks ago. Lovely. Um, after a show, she was doing wrapping... Um, netting cabochons. Lovely. And I'd never netted a cabochon before. Okay. So she you said have she'd now. show me how to do it. <laughs> Fabulous So stuff. I thought it would work really well with this because um, it, it depth just to it. real, mm. yeah, make sure it's really secure um, but not become too cluttered mm, or idea. dominant mm -hmm. as a, a setting. So I just thought we'd, we'd do that. Right. Lovely so. Stuff. Take a length of your 0.8 wire, mm -hmm. and I guess it's about 15 inches, okay. something like that. You won't use all of it, but it's better to have a bit more so okay, that it's then. easier to work with. And then in the center, just fold it. And I'm just using um, a mandrel, step mandrel. Yep. Um, so if you've got pliers, you could use those. Um, if not a pen or anything really. Okay. Um, just check that the cabochon sits. So if I, I'll turn it that way. Yeah. So you want the wire to sit just on the inside yep. of the, the cabochon. So that's a little bit big. So I'll just shrink it down a bit, make it a bit smaller. And then just move the wire, fold it round at the top there. I think that should be about the right size, so we'll measure it up again. Yep, that looks good. So you want so that to sit just inside, just inside. the perimeter of your, yep. of your cabochon. Okay. Yep. And then just take flat nose pliers and at the very top of that oval, just flick those okay. up. So they're then standing up, and that's that's what forms the little heart-shaped section at the top. Okay. And the yep. bail. Okay, so smooth those out. And once you've got that, you need some 0.4 wire. So, let's see, 0.4. I actually used all of the 0.4 up in this kit. I'm not, I'm not I had surprised. That statement necklace that you've got in the uh, with the tanzanite the other one that yeah. you've got is very 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 beautifully um i want to say wire heavy but in a lovely is, way yeah. you know what i mean generous yeah, yeah. i just 
fancy doing something quite different and sculptural. Yeah, lovely. It looks fab. Absolutely yeah. fabulous. I love the fact that it's, it's sort of like a wave and then you've yeah. got this tangle, this web and this weave. It's beautiful. Really lovely. The, the pearl cut wire is gorgeous, isn't it? I think it's, um, it's, it's got a real high-end quality mm. about it. Mm. And I think it looks really expensive when you use it in a piece. I just think... I, I don't know what it is about it's it. It's sheen to quite it, a soft it? Mm. look. I think it's very bridal. I think it's yeah. It's, it, um, I would say next to the because the champagne um, yeah, colour for me yeah. is my number one favourite. That's definitely a second. Yeah, definitely. I love Lovely. it. I think it's it's so perfect so for this cool. kit. Perfect. Yeah, and it's not too dominant. So you're looking at it as you see the shapes mm. of the wire, but you. It's definitely the colour of the yeah. tanzanite that jumps forward rather than a luster coming definitely. off the silver, yeah, it's which is nice. Although I've discovered that you can um, rub it back and get a silver coming through so oh, you can okay. combine it in areas, nice. which is quite nice. So I'll stop rabbiting. Right, point four wire. <laughs> <coughs> um, so it's just, oh, I should measure it, shouldn't I? <laughs> Be good, measure it, 20 <laughs> inches. Okay. Right, so what I did was I took the wire and just wrapped it probably about, I don't know, four inches in from the end. Okay. Around one of the struts going up into the bale. So just okay. wrap it round at the end, push it together, make sure it's neat, and then bring that down to the bottom. Okay where your oval is and then what we need to do is wrap so this is a slight variation on what Laura told me because mm -hmm. obviously I'm not very good at following instruction. No, but I think it's <laughs> lovely that you get the basics from someone like yeah. Laura who's incredibly experienced with um, weaving and wire wrapping yeah. and then and then you do your own thing with it as well. Yeah yeah I just uh, did what I've I wanted to do with it in yeah, my of way. So, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. I mean, that's what it's all about, really, mm -hmm. isn't it? Definitely. The way we do it. So, what I'm doing now, I've come down the one side, yep. and now I'm wrapping these two tails together with about three or four wraps okay. at the bottom. And then I need to just come up on the outside yep. of the oval. Come down into the loop yep. through the centre and then pull the tail through that loop. Okay. And I got told off in the workshop. Oh, no! I know! Yeah. Never! She did. She told me off <laughs> for making the loops too small. Okay. So I had a bit of an argument with her. <laughs> Was there fisty, but, fisty cuffs at dawn? Oh, no! <laughs> What she said was, if you make the um, loops too small, you have to do more rows to then come oh, around okay. the caption. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So if you make the loops a bit bigger, you only need two rows instead of three. So, okay, so. okay. She does There's know her stuff. There's logic there. She knows the stuff. So we're just going to do two rows of, of loops. Okay. And what I, I tended to do, because I got a bit sort of fixated on them all being the same size, was I used my pliers okay. and then pulled the the point four okay. in to the loop. So I'm then going to bring the wire back round through the centre and then pull it through here again. Use my pliers, pop them in and just pull it tight. So the only thing with doing that is you have to make sure you're putting it at the same point on your plier mm -hmm. each time. So just work your way all the way round. So I'm just going to show everyone at home what what's because you yeah, haven't had a chance to are. see this side on. So, so you, you can just see you've seen the cabochon. You can see where that beautiful base was that um, Dad was just talking about. And then there's the wire wrapping, and then that's what we're working on. That section there. Yeah. Thank you, sweetheart. Okay. So I've got eleven loops. So if I flatten them down, I've got 11 loops yeah. coming off mm -hmm. and around. And I'm back up to the top now. Yeah. So what we need to do is then 
jump across the gap there. Mm -hmm. Just make sure that that's going to come up around the side of your cabochon. Yeah. And you can just ease them in a bit. Just check that fits. Yep, that's going to be perfect. Right. And then I want the the wire to come across. Yeah. And in through the first of the the loops okay. here on that first row. And we'll start doing the second row. So in through the, the first loop. Yeah. And then bring the tail. But you through. don't need to use the pliers for this section? Um I didn't for the first one to come across. Okay. Um because that's slightly different in that it's coming across a strain, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. a different size gap, really. So pop in the cabochon once you've got that one in place. Okay. Okay, and then loop around through the, f the next loop yep. in the first row and up through the gap. So hold the wire where yep. you've just been so it doesn't move too much and then you can just give that a wiggle mm -hmm. and the loop the, the stitch i suppose will just close yeah, down it does, a bit it, i suppose it is in a way because yeah, you're just threading you're just it stitching and holding around yeah. so it's a really simple clean effect I'll give it a little tug so i'll just go all the way around here it's so therapeutic Oh, it's really nice, actually. Yeah, I'd never, I'd never really got into netting. I used mm. to do prong setting quite a lot yeah. and um, macrame as well. Mm, mm. I'm doing doing that, but yeah, it's quite nice. Did you enjoy working with the kit? Oh, I just loved it. I, I love the size of the pearls. Um, they're so they're so they're feminine, really aren't they? Nice. They're so pretty. Yeah, really nice. Just works nice. beautifully with the rondelles. Absolutely stunning. And because I love rosary linked um, chain, it was just yeah, it does look fun. Too too good an opportunity to resist. Really, is absolutely beautiful. Now there is some pearl chain. Oh, yeah, it's that's gorgeous, nice, isn't one? it? Really lovely. Um, I don't think I've seen. Yeah, that's really nice. Sizzling yeah. silver with the textured. pearls. Yeah, textured silver work as well. Really and nice. The pearls suspended in between. If you're looking to work yeah. with that big cabbage. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Now we're talking. <laughs> Beautiful. Fantastic. And, and actually, the texture that I put onto the, the wire, mm. onto the heart section yeah. there, is mirrored. With the Definitely. texture here. Definitely. So, and you could as well, I suppose, perfect. like you have with the tanzanites here on the rosary link, mm -hmm. you could suspend maybe a couple of tanzanites yeah. in the centre of those, yeah. wouldn't it? Yeah. That would be to rosary be really the suspender and the tanzanites. So you've got your pearl and your tanzanites continuing in that chain. Love yeah. 1995. There's so much silk. 5.8 grams of silk. 5.8 grams of solid selling silver. At 14.95, again, solid selling silver, 5.8 grams, beautifully already done for you. And then with the pearls suspended in between all of those already done, 14.95. Add that to your order. Oh, if that would that. take that kit just that a little bit further again, wouldn't it? Would, it? Yeah, it really would, yeah. Really beautiful. Very, very, very elegant. And Works really well with the tanzanite. Because the tanzanite is such a good colour, you mm. would only need one piece in, in each of, like, the alternate um, absolutely loops the, the color of the tans light and again i've got yeah you've, we've got one here that you've used already in the kit that you had at home we've got the other one here we've got the one that you're using yeah we can see the consistency of color throughout the three of them yeah yeah they are all beautiful amazing quality. absolutely beautiful this one's actually got a huge amount of clarity as well and this is the thing it's the look of the draw to it isn't it Beautiful body of colour. Really gorgeous. That's fantastic. Lovely size. 12 by 9 to reiterate the sizes of your tanzanite. Thank you, sweetheart. Oh, you're welcome. Make sure yeah. you're adding that beautiful chain. Amazing value. Solid stunning silver, 5.8 grams of the pearls. Yeah. Amazing value. And to actually get it made for you. That's um, what I was saying earlier about that. Because yeah. I know that you love to rosary lake, but it is time consuming. Yeah. 
You know, it, it is, it's, it's a labour of love because the effect is amazing on it. I think it probably took me about seven or eight hours mm. easily to do yeah. that. Um, might have even been more, you know. So it was... Uh, it's beautiful. It's well, yeah. well worth it if you've, got the, if you've got the time and the patience for it. It's beautiful. I love the, uh, the effect of it is amazing. I'm a bit obsessive about the size of my loops as well. <laughs> they are gorgeous. <laughs> um, we have got... Yeah, of course we can. Yeah, somebody's messaging saying that the tanzanite cabochon would look lovely shaboried. Oh, it would, yes. Yeah. And the pearls and the tanzanite would look beautiful shaboried. Yeah, they Shibor would. Is shaboried a verb? I'm going to say it. It is now. It is now. Mm. Shaboried. Yeah, <laughs> it would look nice. Yeah, it would. Um, so just a tiny dot of glue on the yeah. back and pop it onto the shibori. Yeah, that would be lovely. It would be gorgeous. Um, unfortunately, we only have the... Did the amethyst and the copper shibori from earlier sell out? We only had the... Uh, yeah, I'm afraid the only shibori that we had tonight had, uh, had sold out. So I'm really sorry about that. But yes, it would be. Anonymous customer who messaged in, yeah, it would be gorgeous to shibori with. I agree. It would. Right, my lovely. Yeah. Right, so we've gone all the way around for the second yep. row. Just make sure it's centred up. Yeah. Okay, and push, push the, the loops in so they're sitting nice mm -hmm. and tight on the, the stone. And then what we're going to do is bring the tail of the wire yep. round and I've just pushed it through between the first loop and the wire frame. Yeah. Try not to get it kinked. <laughs> <laughs> and then bring it across and just smooth out these sections and then what I did was bring that longer tail and wrapped it yep. around the um, the point eight yeah so it puts that texture on mm, does I suppose it was as well, it sort of just strengthens it as well, doesn't it? Yeah, I suppose it does actually, yeah, yeah. And what I I've did as well, so that it, it provides a bit more structure and strength mm. coming up, is then pulled these two together, yeah. mm -hmm. and that's where I popped yeah. the little um, tanzanite over the top. So... It's got that lovely little rondelle, just yeah. bringing a little bit of colour that heart shape lovely stuff so I've come up to the same point as the wrapping yep. on the other side and then just bring your wire across the two and trap trap them together and then it just opens up so what I did was then carry on wrapping yeah. over the top mm -hmm. and carried on wrapping with the tail yeah. up this one. But I won't do that now because that'll take a couple of minutes. It's suspended the tanzanite in place, I suppose, yeah. as part of the bale, hasn't it? Yeah, so that's now just locked on there yeah. and it's also holding So at the moment, on the back together. of the cabochon, what, is there anything? No, so okay, so it's just suspended in the basket weave at the yeah. moment. Yeah, okay. Yeah. So because your frame is slightly smaller than the cabochon, mm. the, the stone can't come no, through no, no, no. on the back. Yeah. But what I wanted was just a little bit of um, detail on the back yeah. to just... Well, yeah, if it rotates just, on the neckline yeah. anyway, it's nice to have yeah. something, isn't it? It is. So to do the heart section, yeah. all you need is pull the, the wires up straight and then you can decide how big you want sort of the curve in yeah. the heart so if we go quite large come round the mandrel and back down yeah and then what we're going to do is snip both of those wires at the back trim them down and then just push it in at the back slightly yeah then we can Actually, I need to trim that a little bit more. There we 
we go, that's better. Just make a couple of loops on the end. Okay. So that will give us an anchor point then to attach to the side of the frame. So one, this one coming this way. And then straighten those wires up. It's pretty, it does give that little bit of detail as you were it saying, is, if, yeah. if the pendant spins around on the neckline. Just see that little level of detail, that pretty, it, and the blue is so strong, that violet blue yep. is still so strong in the tans, like it still shows through, doesn't it? It is, yeah, it's amazing, absolutely amazing. So um, all I did then was stitch the loops yep. at the back onto the frame, mm -hmm. onto the point so eight. So with a little bit more of the point four? A bit more of point okay. four. And then you can open up the heart at the front and the, the two sides of the heart. It's really pretty, really we'll pretty. Equal, yeah, so. gorgeous. So really that's... lovely. I love the fact that the blue of the tanzanite isn't compromised. The blue, no. the, the, that violet blue is still exposed. You can still see it through the lovely basket weave on the side. Yeah. When it spins around on the back, you're still going to get to see it. Because you're making, like you were saying, that cabochon just speaks for itself, doesn't it? It does, yeah. You don't need to overcomplicate no, it at all. Absolutely fab. Um, do make sure that you're checking out of your kit. Thank you so much. She doesn't Welcome. going anywhere. She's staying here all the way through the next half an hour <laughs> because we've got Miss It Miss Out coming your way. Any more questions that you have for Debs, you need to get them in the next 10 minutes or so that, so we can bombard her with more of her jewelry making questions. <laughs> um, and of course, uh, we've got another half hour with you and literally Miss It Miss Out. Thank you so much, my darling. Very, very Pleasure. much indeed. Um, come back because, say that again for me. Oh, that's brilliant. In that case, then I shall stay here and I'll see you there in a second. <laughs>
Fab. They've just got the most amazing sparkle. Hi, Dorothy. Hi, Jenny. Hi, Helen. Hi, Heather. Nicole and Caroline and Denise, anonymous collectors. Great to see you. Well done indeed to you. Lots of you on the phone lines that are pressure, but one, welcome. Just make sure that you're staying at this 10 in basket. It's not checked out as yet. <sighs> Gonna need to. It's miss it, miss out. Ooh. All the way through. They are fabulous, aren't they? They are. And it would be really nice to actually contrast the, the high shine and metal with um, Eslon threads yeah. and the colour. Really um, nice. Yeah, yeah, definitely. They look good that way if you uh, layer them up. Mm, really nice. With thread, yeah. Well, I'll tell you what, you're going to have so much to play with these. 15 in baskets, please do make sure that you're checking them out. They are lots of stock. It is under £5 for them. And they're not tiny, tiny little. They are really beautifully diamond cut, sparkly, lovely spaces. That slight curve as well, when you've got that, yeah. just show that, that slight curve as a connector point on a bracelet mm. when it catches the light because the slight curve it just sits on the wrist beautifully just takes on the contour of the wrist really really easily um, so many of you there lovely to have your company tonight thank you so much we've got 20-ish minutes left of miss it miss out make sure that you're checking out on those loads of you multivine which is lovely to see really really big well done to you indeed on that one uh, next one that we've got for you for your miss it miss out tonight is yep Oh, lots of stock on some really, really wow. cracking quality aquamarine. Um, Nigerian aquamarine. Um, wow, really? Okay. I know, I know this strand, I know this gemstone from this location really well. It's Sokoto. Not Sokota, Sokoto. Aquamarine, Nigerian. Um, I've worked with this gemstone probably for about seven years. I've never seen a strand of it as beautifully bright and as aquamarine as this is. And look at the brilliance. It is off the chart. You know, earlier on, when I was saying to Paul about a little bit of soft focus on that beautiful Swarovski um, mesh, let's just, just have a little bit of... Sorovsky yes. moment. If this is not, this is genuine aquamarine and enhanced from Nigeria. Let's get a little bit of soft focus on it and watch the brilliance on this. Mm -hmm. Top quality strand. And then Phil has just said, for last chance opportunities, it's going it's going under 20. It's not stopping at 24.90. It's last the stock is missing miss out. Please <laughs> make sure you are so quick. We've got nine strands left in the world. Reduced oh. to 19.95. Oh, in heaven right now. Aren't you? For yep. genuine and enhanced aquamarine with sparkle and brilliance and clarity and true sky blue colour. 19.95. Should be paying £25. Some of you will have done that before. This is last of stock, the last nine strands. Phenomenal to work with that sort of quality and clarity and without any heat treatment. Half of them out the door already. Just make sure that you're checking out. There's loads of you there. Please make sure you're holding lines. 25 pence for an extra added security deal there with the, secu the, the uh, certificate of authenticity. All unenhanced. I think that's amazing. I think that's incredible, yeah. Normally, and, and sort of I would say it's a little bit like when you say 95% of all of your sapphires across the world are treated. I would say that a bigger proportion of your aquamarine is heat treated because you're trying to eliminate the green part of the iron that comes into an aquamarine because you want that purity of the sky blue colour. So you heat treat it to eliminate the greens. When Mother Nature does that naturally for you in the ground, that's amazing. She says no to those green tones, the green hues, and brings you those bright, amazing, brilliant sky blues. Very exciting at under 20. It really, really is. Very last of stock on that one. Do make sure that you are checking out and confirming as soon as you can. Stunning, stunning quality. Five of you talking to our call centre at the moment. Lovely to have your company. Good evening. Hope you're well. Those of you on the web need to check out as soon as you possibly can. Last nine strands. Not, another, not 90 strands. Not 19 strands. The last nine strands. Normally, you'd be paying £25 for it. We've reduced it to under 20 for you for tonight for the last nine. The lucky nine. 
Kimberly, Annette and Dorothy, all yours. Well, well done. Seven of you on the phone lines now. Now that means that one of you will be disappointed because we only had nine. That'll be a shame. Hold those lines, well done, well done, well done. Minute on two. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Yeah. This would work well with the kit that we just had Ooh, with the Tanzanite. Oh, yes. Isn't it? Yeah, it would. There's so much Beautiful. Tanzanite on this strand, though. There these is. These um, pear drop strands that you get from us, it's almost a double strand. Say that again. Mmm. Absolutely chock a block. Look at it. Every millimetre every millimeter of that chock a block. You could take the top row of tanzanite out, have the bottom row, you've got a full on strand. We have literally laden that with your tanzanite. Nice, sizable, beautiful tanzanites as well, aren't they? They are, yeah. The largest um, ones on this strand, you're looking at 10 millimetres on the drop. That's a centimetre drop on tanzanite. <laughs> it's really <laughs> substantial. 80 carats, beautiful blues. It would work so well with the rondelles and the cabochon. Yeah. So well, wouldn't they? Just popping one of drilled. those on the bottom of the earrings. Mm, lovely. Really, really nice. nice. Really, really nice. Last six strands. 17 centimetre strand. 39.95. So much tanzanite on this strand. You think about it, it's top and tailed. Every single one mm. of those beautiful, it, isn't it? Yeah, it is. There's no way we could get any more on there. No. Nope. It's, yeah. Totally and they're top drilled on. and they're very, very yes. definitely top drilled, aren't they? You know, it's not one of them there that's sort of drilled through the centre accidentally. You can see top drilled, so really workable. Thirty nine ninety five for the last of stock on those ones, all genuine. And what I will say to you is, it absolutely take the next step and get that get that certificate of authenticity. Um, there are there was a story in the GIA very very recently about how a lot of jewellers are being duped because they're getting tanzanite that is being coated. Um, so it's a, almost a sort of beige tanzanite that's getting a colour on top of it um, and it's being sold for hundreds and hundreds and hundreds. Um, the reason you know that this is authentic, it's the real deal and it's only received heat treatment is of course because this is the real deal from the Russian mountains of Tanzania, from the Merilani Hills of Tanzania, the real deal, the only place in the world that produces this gemstone at 39.95. Last six strands, down to the last four. Hold the signs, well done, well, well done indeed. Now moving on to, yeah, of course we can. Nine carat gold crimp beads. Now I would not be using these as crimp beads. I would be using these mm -hmm. as little gold spaces yep. in a in, very high end. You'd have in to. In between the um, pink opal Oh the yeah, squares. they would look amazing. Mm. Yeah, they would look amazing. Definitely. These are genuine gold. These are not gold overlay. These are not gold overlay at all. These are bright yellow gold. Nine carat yellow gold. Two millimetres. Think of your delicas. Think of how you work with your delicas, how they are of perfect size, their uniformity, they've got the same. You could incorporate genuine nine carat yellow gold to a really beautiful piece of jewellery then, couldn't yeah. you? Because they yeah. have that delicate feel, that the delica, I should say, delica um, sort of appearance and mm -hmm. sort of shape and size, don't they? Yeah, yeah, they do. They're um, really clean. Yeah, they well. are. Nice. Really clean. Really um, nicely made. Nine carat yellow gold. Yeah, of course, if you have a nine carat yellow gold clasp, I, I'll be honest with you, I can count on one hand the amount of genuine yellow gold that I've had with you since I've been back in... Oh. <laughs> We're about to take these to 10.95. Ooh. For real gold. I think that's amazing. For nine carat yellow gold to take your beautiful jewellery that little bit further. It just gives it such a boutique feel, a high-end wow. feel, doesn't it? And some of the gemstones that we get through definitely warrant absolutely. A, a gold yeah. finish. So yeah, yeah, absolutely. I'd love to see some more, I'd love to see more yellow gold findings. Yes. Yeah. For that, for those commissions, I'm not saying that we get a lot in, but say we bought 50 packs 
and maybe 50 clasps mm -hmm. or uh, and maybe so, you know just just taking your jewelry to another level i'd like to see some small amount of gold coming through i yeah, think wouldn't you it would it would be really good because a lot of times we're we're saying oh these really deserve a high-end finish for this strand of gemstones yeah and to be able to to get it here would be oh absolutely you know, just a really good thing i, I think so i really really think so i think that um i think mm. without a doubt i think for those of you that have been making jewelry for a very long time now and you're you love your high-end silver pieces yeah. but you're ready to move to that yellow yeah. gold next that's yeah. an, i think that's an exciting opportunity i really it's very very less of stock please check out on those huge good luck i think that's amazing value absolutely mesmerizing great opportunity next mm -hmm. it is awesome morganite this is very true um very very sparkly morganite again i've been a little bit spoiled tonight by phil he's given us some lovely morganite some lovely aquamarine to play with this evening 60 carats of madagascan morganite amazing quality now you can see the quality I'm just gonna leave those there for a sec and just pick up oh good I was gonna ask <laughs> you to do that <laughs> there we go <laughs> mm -mm. <laughs> oh I am a happy bunny right now they are beautiful yeah the colors amazing isn't it it is really Player. proper pink and blues yeah the twins together for your aquamarine yes, more than yeah. the barrel family absolutely mesmerizing now what i'm going to do i'm going to pop those blues back in their box because we've already seen those this evening but give you a chance to see i mean the brilliance is exceptional and the clarity is exceptional on your screen mm. but to see madagascan rose pinks they are mesmerizing, aren't they? 21 centimeter strand, uh, four to seven millimeters on the diameter. Sparkle, oh yes. Not tonight. It is a very high end, you've got to remember Madagascar, of course, originally found in, in uh, very small amounts in California in 1902, uh, sorry, 1911, I should say, in 1911. And then Madagascar is where George Frederick Kunz went to find the world's biggest, biggest deposit. It is spectacular. It is, it is synonymous with Tiffany, without a doubt. And we've taken a massive chunk up. That's £15 reduction tonight for the last of stock. Now, don't get me wrong. If you want to pay £70 for this, that's okay. You can wait maybe another time where it's not miss it, miss out. That's not a problem. That's fine. I do understand. But if you want to get this high-end luxury strand, and work with and who wouldn't want to work with morganite yeah it's a beaut it's an absolute beaut it really is such a sensationally sensationally fiery beauty but very delicate and alluring at the same time 54.95 on your screen make sure that you're checking that out huge good luck massive saving next we've got for you number 14 yeah so we've got brass seed beads for you They've got the most amazing size drill hole. Mm. I mean, how are they going to just pass through so many times, aren't they? Yeah, yeah. And probably, um, I think they fit onto the 1.5 oh, millimetre wire. Yeah. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Now, I know that they, I know that they are seed bead size, but mm -hmm. actually, we haven't got a seed bead size on it, so we don't. We, we know it's no. three mil, but we don't know if it's a size eight or a size eleven or or that sort of it, you yeah, know, it's comparison in size. Yeah, they're but just like a space can, bead. Yeah, yeah, you can see it has got a large size drill hole, to build, and like mm. like Debs was saying. Yeah, absolutely. Um, they're antique copper colour as well, which I know is a yeah. lot of our guest designers' favourite colour wire to work with. It's a good colour, and to get the the beads that that actually match is really nice so yeah if you're into your wire work these are absolutely perfect for um, just popping in every now and again well i'm told reliably by phil that these are an equivalent of an 8-0 according yeah, they to look about 8 -0, yeah? yeah yeah that's fantastic isn't it lovely colors can make a real feature out of these or like you're yeah. saying then just a little just a little hint of that rich color here and there 
Yeah. Really nice. Or just make stretchy bracelets with them. Yeah, they're fabulous. And layer them up. Really good idea. And the jewelry elastic would more than pass yeah, through there, wouldn't easily. it? Easily. Yeah. Nine ninety five. Nine ninety five for the entire tube. Uh, these are antique copper coloured brass seed beads. It says three millimetres, but obviously, as Phil says, it's equivalent to a size eight or. <laughs> <laughs> uh, make sure that you're checking those out when you're 35 grams it's saying there <laughs> uh, approximately 700 in a tube day to count more <laughs> <laughs> you could just you could just just look you know when you're playing the, the game when you're just guessing how many sweets are in the jar oh yeah <laughs> Oh, there'll be 9.95 on your screen make sure that you're checking out moving on then to now uh -huh, uh -huh. Pop those back in there. Now we've got for you your gold plated brass rondelle seed beads. Three by two, approximately 750 that we're getting here. Do you know the size of these in Ato as well, my lovely? Oh, they're a rondelle, so it won't have, it won't be some. Okay, that's fine. Thank you, sweetheart. So they're a rondelle. Oh, which we are ah, right. Okay, because they are slightly. Slightly, yeah. Yeah, they are slightly squeezed, mm. aren't they? Okay, there we go. I can see them properly now in the pack. Yeah, they are slightly. Um, three to two millimeters. Seven hundred and fifty. Oh, sorry, seven hundred and fifty in the pack. Yeah, definitely has seven hundred and fifty approximately. Nine ninety-five. Nice bright color. They are. Really nice, mm. actually. The quality of the plating. Them? Yeah, yeah. I've used them quite a lot, and I, I like using them um, with my wire work. Just, it just puts a little dot. Yeah, a little emphasis. Almost like, a, mm. yeah, a little full stop in there, or um, just a bit of a, a feature. Yeah, so, lovely stuff. Yeah. Lovely and bright. Nine ninety five on your screen. Well done. Make sure that you're checking out on that one. Gorgeous. So that again, my lovely. Let's do that. Just don't go anywhere. We've got some amazing fluorites coming away next. Look at these colours. They are... Now, it's colourway day. We've worked from the pinks and we've worked through to those beautiful purples. We've worked through to the blues. And in this strand, we are seeing tealy greens, pinks, and purples in your fluorite strand. Six to eight millimetres on the graduation. Amazing amounts. I don't know if you're getting a chance to see how much green is actually in this strand. The light passes through it, and there is some amazing jade green coming through here. There's little shots of it, these tealy greens. Every single one of the gemstones that you're seeing here is totally natural. And unenhanced. Look at that amount of colour that you can work with. There's an amethyst colour, there's a beautiful soft morganite, there's some really lovely deep, 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 gorgeous teal blues. Any aubergine? And, yeah, <laughs> bit of eggplant, <laughs> bit of dark orchid, it's all there for you lovely. Um, absolutely. I tell you what, the lust is magnificent, isn't it? It is. Absolutely. Multicolour fluorite, 110 carats, 17 centimetre strand, 14.95. Beautiful natural gemstone to work with. It really, really is. And see, you can see now as we come back from that, you can just see some delicate pinks, the little peach tones coming through there. And that's because the entire strand is unenhanced. It's all genuine. Perfect for bracelets, perfect for necklaces, Perfect for earrings. Yeah, absolutely. You could protect a few of these fluorites with some maybe some channel setting in a ring, but really it's made for bracelets, necklaces, and of course for earrings uh, because of its hardness on the Mohs scale. Fourteen ninety five. You're gonna get so much to play with with regard to those colours. Really, really are. It's got a lot of luster, hasn't it? It has, yeah. The faceting really works with mm -mm, that strand, doesn't it? Just really works. And daylight. Loves this gemstone. UV light makes this gemstone fluoresce and it really, really does as well. So again, when you're out in sunlight, it's going to look mesmerising. Mm. Now, I don't know why these greens, these, there are greens in the studio 
that are really, really strong in the studio lights. But I don't think that you're seeing oh. that green down the camera lens. Oh, there's a little bit just there. Bit, just a yeah. little bit of that jade teal green. Yeah. Jumping out. We can see that multi-tonal beautiful strand, can't you? All there for you, $14.95. Very, very, very last to stock on that one. Do make sure that you're checking it out on absolutely everything that you've got tonight. Uh, this is from Celine. Hi, Ray. Do you think these four white beads will fluoresce? They absolutely should do. They've got beautiful clarity, Celine. So there are moments on this strand where you should see some true fluorescence, definitely. Got a 30-day money-back guarantee, of course, with this. Don't forget that. But they definitely should. Um, if, it was, if it was opaque, if there wasn't a lot of clarity, I would say that it, you'd struggle to see mm. the fluorescence. But because they've got great clarity, and you can see that some of them, I think, will fluoresce beautifully. $14.95. Make sure that you're checking out and confirm as soon as you can. Now, um, we've got a little bit of a recap for you on the deal of the day. Is that these beauties that are like... The, oh, these are gorgeous. Oh. Okay. So we had that beautiful abalone shell earlier in the heart design. Have a look at this. Oh my goodness me. Ooh. They are absolutely breathtaking, aren't they? Beautiful, beautiful pieces. And our beading bells have popped some on some shibori, wire wrapped, one of them is a big pendant, and suspended another one on a really, really beautiful detail chain. Um, some amazing iridescence. 20 pounds for all three of them. They are gorgeous. They are really nice. The pearlescence yeah. and the radiance on those is amazing, isn't it? Yeah, I love, again, the fact that oh, they're, they're so, um, they thinner are, on the yeah. edges and they've got that slight dome to them. And they're so smooth. Yeah. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful tactility to this. Gorgeous. 19 at 95 today's deal of the day. Last chance to get that, unless you're watching the repeat later. Three very, very sizable pieces. And just to kind of give you an idea how one of our amazing beading bells has worked with one of these, let me just show you. Popcorn necklace, beautiful, beautiful big bale. Mm. That looks impressive, really doesn't it? Really good. Really yeah, impressive. It does. Uh, she's also worked with some shibori as a cuff and also a, a beautiful wire wrapped pendant also. Just to give you ideas of how you could work with these. I'm in love with those. They yeah. are beautiful, absolutely gorgeous. Really tactile mm, again. Definitely. Yeah. Gorgeous, gorgeous quality. Love them. Listen, do make sure that you are joining us. Uh, Lara Deleu joins you for tomorrow night's Late Show. The gorgeous oh, Lara. Yay. Love Lara. Uh, so give her a big warm welcome when you see her tomorrow cool. night from six. Uh, we won't be here because no. we will be eating food somewhere. Partying. And, yeah, generally. After some yoga disco or disco yoga. I'm doing beer tasting. <laughs> <laughs> Are you eating some chicken nuggets? No, I won't. Um, <laughs> $27.95 on your screen for the kit. It's practically sold out. Please do make sure that you are checking out on that one. Thank you to Phil and, of course, to Paul in the gallery tonight. Thank you to Emma and Becky on floor. Thank you. Thank you. Impromptu challenges tonight that you <laughs> well and truly stepped up to the mark with. Fantastic kits and gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous demos as well. So please thank Debs for uh, this evening. Thank you, Debs, very much indeed. Thank you. Thank you to you for joining us. Um, tomorrow night, uh, so tomorrow morning, who's with you tomorrow morning? Is it lovely? Is it Carol tomorrow morning? Oh no, it won't be well because lots of people are coming to the. Yep, yeah, it won't be Al. Al's coming no, with us as well. I think it's Lucy tomorrow yeah, morning Lucy with you. Lucy is working tomorrow. Yeah, Lucy's I don't know with what you show. tomorrow. And then I know that Ellen is coming with us. I know. Uh, we're going to have a <laughs> lovely day tomorrow with all of the immediate, immediate family get to, uh, getting together from all walks of life, from radio times, from offices, everywhere. Uh, so that will be really, really nice. Apart from the fact that we are on live television and so some mm. people still have to be here. I worked last year, so I can party this year. 
party. Um, we will see you very, very soon. And we'll see you on Friday. So thank you so much for joining us. When are you back with us after today? A week tomorrow. Gorgeous stuff. So uh, we will join you. Well, I'll see you on Friday. Uh, she'll see you in a week tomorrow. And then you've got lo lovely Laura Delu tomorrow night from 6. Uh, thank you so much for your company tonight. Thank you to the team as well. And I will see you on Friday. Have a great few days. Keep an eye on Facebook. I'll pop some photos of tomorrow's festivities yes. online for you. Don't go anywhere. <laughs>